Ah, greetings and salutations, everyone. It's Adrian here. Welcome to a late night live sale with a. But wait, where are you? This side, our special guest. Doo, 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 doo. It's, it's me, me. Woo. <laughs> from Tell Your Friends Sportswear on Instagram. I have all her info right there, you guys. If you guys want to go give her a follow on Instagram, she's amazing. She's also on Whatnot. She does fun Whatnot sales. And um, I'm really excited. Tonight is our early Black Friday sale. And we have a ton of stuff. Look at V's background, though. I'm so jealous. Like, she's so fast. I already decorated. I know. I know. It's I so had cool. to get the spirit. No, I love it. Okay, wait. Let's see who's in here really quick. There's Sister of a Down. Hello, Dodo Bird. There's Pinai Plant Mom. <laughs> There's Marion, there's Hannah, Lady Badger. Hi, Peace. How are you? There's Edie. How are you, Edie? Hope you're doing well. Pauline. There's Dawn. Hi, Linda. Hi, guys. Look at us. We're like, I was almost on time today. Only eight minutes late. That's nothing. Right? I'm like, I'm actually early. That 808, um, thank you. <laughs> There's Melissa, Monchetti, there's Ashley, Liz, Kathleen, hi guys, Carmen, Tara, J Sweet, hello. Um, V, you can't see your comments right now because her iPad Not is yet. charging. My iPad so, is charging. Yeah, so I'm, I'm going to be reading out any comments you have for her and stuff too, so. She's taking a hot minute. <laughs> hi, Fanny, hi guys. Um, so the sale is pretty much going to work the same uh, but for anything that V is selling tonight, uh, you have her email is right there. So you can just send her an email and she'll, uh, she can send you an invoice or you guys can, um, PayPal her and then, or, business, yeah. Or you can PayPal. yeah, all that info is actually in the description box too, to make it easier. So it's not like all jumbled on the screen, but I just have our basic info right here on the screen for you guys. But in the description box of the video has every, all the info down there for any purchases that you guys are making for the night. But it's pretty easy, it's pretty much the same, except we have our friend V here, so I'm very excited. I'm here, Merry Christmas, Happy Kwanzaa, <laughs> Happy Hanukkah. Oh, we, when is Hanukkah this year? I'd have to ask Jenna. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know, soon? Kathleen, I'm gonna see if I want to order anything else. Oh yeah, that's totally fine, Kathleen. That's okay, yeah, no worries. We'll just keep adding on to anything you like. And there's Marjorie. Yeah. <laughs> so V has some really great stuff tonight, and I'm really yeah. excited. She gave me a little sneak peek of her stuff. And mm -hmm. she has some really great items for you guys tonight. Um, to oh, we need to think of a giveaway question for tonight. And our oh, giveaway okay. uh, giveaway is actually really fun. I got some key sunglasses right here. And they Ooh, are Thanksgiving key? themed. They're orange and yellow. Oh my gosh, I'm so, giving Blue Cantrell, like hit him up nice. style. Hey ladies, <laughs> I, wanna give a I love that song. But yeah, this is tonight's giveaway, you guys. Help you think of a giveaway question. And then I'm going to get the link for the giveaway, which would be... Have you already done, like, a Thanksgiving question? <gasps> uh, we have, have a done, couple. Like, we have done a couple. Like, to this morning I had a live sale. And the question was, what is your favorite Thanksgiving side dish? No, I need a, what are you thankful for? Like, I need Oh, yeah, what are you thankful for for this year? Deep. That is a good one. Okay. It is that deep. Okay. Yes. I'm thankful for this cup from Hadrian for my, when I bought my house. It's so cute. And this empty bottle of Prosecco from Trader Joe's. Thank you. <laughs> I love it. Let me put up the question. Ugh. I want my iPad to turn on so I can see if I'm making the people laugh or not. <laughs> oh my goodies. Give away question. Do it, do it, do it, do it. You know the world be rocking to it, to it. So do it, do it. Oh, I got the sugar cookie Hershey kiss. Oh, yeah. I saw you eating those earlier. <laughs> okay, so this is our question right here, you guys. I'm actually just kind of place it up at the very top. So this is a giveaway question right there. Leave your answer in the comments of, the, of that video that I linked. And at the end of tonight's live sale, we're going to be announcing our winner for our super festive key sunglasses. Perfect for Thanksgiving. I know you're probably not going to get it until after Thanksgiving, but they're still really cute. You can wear them all year round, so. That's right. Yes, it's good. Those are some driving glasses. 
Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're good That's vacation fun. glasses for after the holidays when you need to wind down. What are you drinking? Is that Diet Fanta? Diet Sunkiss. Oh, Sunkiss. <laughs> <laughs> my favorite leave me alone i sold a fanta crop top yesterday what color purple tie-dye <sighs> and it said fanta i know purple fanta is actually my favorite fanta it was orange fanta on a purple tie-dye it was very oh. confusing hmm. but whatever whatever it's cool hi dg house hi ashley hi guys dg house what's up <laughs> Everyone's like slowly trickling in. So this is our question for tonight, you guys, okay? And V is here. We're having a party. It's very exciting. She's drinking some Prosecco? What was it? Yeah, it's grapefruit. It's from Trader Joe's. It's grapefruit delicious. Prosecco from Trader Joe's. So you guys gotta go up there and try it if you um if you partake. Yeah, I was having a hard time deciding between like mango, grapefruit, and peach bellini. Oh my gosh, I forgot you're allergic, aren't you? Yeah, so I, I don't drink alcohol, but... Oh, that's depressing. <laughs> Only because like around the holidays, the drinks are just so like festive and like... It's not even about the alcohol per se, it's just like figuring out how to make them without alcohol. Uh, and, like like the virgin them. versions? Yeah, yeah, and not having it taste like you just, like, threw sugar and some Kool-Aid. You oh. know what I mean? <laughs> I do just like sugar and Kool-Aid, though. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to figure out. I don't know. Yeah. Um, oh, yeah, Anna, it is going to be 80 degrees in California on Thanksgiving. Yes, it is. What? I'm pretty excited oh about it. I am so cold. I've been marathon training, and we're, I'm on week three, and every time I come in from my run, I'm just like sweaty and then i'm freezing wait how We've cold is it over there been in the 40s so that's cold it is cold if you're stopping but like if you're running yeah. it's actually kind of perfect but today uh, wait how much do you run today? each day um so <laughs> okay if you're not familiar with marathon training how it works is you go you build up and then you taper back so it's, if you're already in shape, which I am, you can do a 10 week um, course. So it goes run. So for example, the first week would be like three, two, three. Those are runs. So like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, three, two, three, rest, cross train for like 30 minutes. And then your long run. The first week's long run is four miles. So then, and then you have like another rest day or a strength and stretch day. And then you repeat it, but each week it goes up a little bit. So it goes like three and a half, two, three and a half, rest, cross, five, and then four, three, four, rest, cross, six, all the way to 10. You just taper up. And then once you get to 10, you do 10, and then you kind of come back down for three weeks, and then you run a half marathon. So you never run more than 10 in your training. So the first time that you run 13 is the race. Ah, so week three, Sounds like intense. Day two is a three and a half mile run. So, oh my gosh, tomorrow's two, Thursday's three and a half, etc. Okay, so. I've never run more than one mile at one time. <laughs> you, <laughs> gain, like, like, endurance, you gain endurance so quickly; it's absurd. Like, you gain it so quickly; it's wild. I don't like being outside. <laughs> but I'm so happy to be here with all of you at the end of the day. Yes. Okay. Oh, this even more people in here. I love Kahlua, but I can't have alcohol anymore. Oh, <gasps> I'm sorry, Kathleen. I it's okay. I don't drink food. alcohol either, so it's fine. We're in it together. We're in. I have th- real eggnog too, like spiked eggnog in my fridge. That's a go-to. You know, it's funny. My cousin brought eggnog to the house the other day but it's just like regular eggnog <laughs> we were drinking that and i was like i didn't even know that they made eggnog without alcohol i was like does this have alcohol in it and she's like no and i was like oh i was like i was wondering why you guys are drinking eggnog for breakfast <laughs> yeah i put it in my coffee either way like on the holidays i'll make spiked eggnog but spiked eggnog yeah yeah in my coffee mm-hmm. it's good how many of our friends are here? Oh, I can see. Wait, is it 57? 57. 
I feel like people are missing. Who's I know missing? it's the holidays, probably. Ugh, Everyone's probably holiday. busy. You know. You don't want to see your Oh my gosh, Hannah, you're crazy. <laughs> are Brina and Jag here? No, I don't see her. Uh, no, I'm <laughs> kidding. <laughs> Bevin's have... in here. Hi, Bevin. Balbazar? Is that Balbazar? No, it's Bevin. No, you're oh. Pokemon. Your Pokemon. Pokemon. Oh, no, this is... <laughs> I don't know their names. This is Snorlax. <laughs> I was so far off. <laughs> I have a magic mushroom. Ooh. I actually have multiple. But... Kathleen says she loves eggnog, but she's lactose intolerant. Oh, oh Kathleen. Sorry, Kathleen. Sorry. All right. Well, I think we should just start. Should we just start? Hi, Lady Badger. Hi, Jane. Yeah, Vadrian's right here. So we're going to go. Vadrian says hi. Love you. Mm. <laughs> All right. Mm. Well, I think you should start since you are a guest of honor for tonight. No, you should start. Me? Yeah. <sighs> okay. I guess I'll start. Mm -hmm. All right, but you guys don't forget to enter the giveaway. I'm gonna leave the link one more enter time. Enter the giveaway. Yeah, don't forget to enter. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, our first item for the evening. I have. Let's do. Oh my gosh, I have so much stuff. I don't even know what to show first. Okay, let's do this. Rebecca Minkoff. Mmm. Mmm. So I have this Ew. really cute Rebecca Minkoff satchel. This is in like a natural tan, almost like a vachetta before it patinas. It's really cute. The only thing is it's missing the crossbody strap. So not, doesn't have that, but the bag is in really, wait, what, Vaderine? Vaderine, oh, Vaderine says you're welcome, Don. Don says she really likes the packaging. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is a super cute Rebecca Minkoff satchel. It has a bunch of like zipper compartments throughout. And I think all of these are actual compartments. Yeah. So all of these are actual pockets that you can put stuff into with the exception of the zippers that go around the bag like that. Like those actually don't have the zipper pulls. They're just decorative. And it goes all along the back as well. Uh, the interior is in good shape as well. There's a zipper pocket and then two open pockets inside of there. And I think the only real flaws on the exterior are very, like, minimal rubbing on the corners. You can see there's a slight discoloration right there. But honestly, like, it's not very noticeable. And right here, this is actually glue from when they make the bag. And over time, it darkens, and that's, yeah, that's like a manufacturer kind of like defecty kind of thing. Uh, but other than that, the bag is in great shape, and this is gonna be item number one our Rebecca Minkoff uh, tan satchel. And we're gonna do this one for just $30. It's gonna be item number one. And it has light gold hardware. Yeah, a separate one. Mm hmm All right. Hi, CF. How are you? Thanks for joining us today. Oh, my gosh. I'm, like, trying to... Oh, are you trying to, like, log in? Or get into yeah, the video? Yeah, it's my YouTube. Okay, hold on. BRB. Yeah, no worries. Just in case. Um, it's me. Thank you. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. Are we good? Yeah. Okay. Okay, you're you're up. What do you got? I'm up. Okay, maybe I should start with the Prada Sunnies. Ooh. I have designer. I do, guys. I know you're not used to it, but I She's do. She's so fancy. Um, you know what's funny? I have found all these pieces with Hadrian on like speed dial. So that's <laughs> funny. Okay, so these are um Prada Tortoise Sunnies. They're they come with the case. They come with the original cleaning cloth like not even opened 
Can you see me? Everything's mm -hmm. good? Everything's good. Perfect. Okay. And then these are them. They're like a little aviator shade. I love They're them. I remember when you got them. Made in Italy. They're 2007. So they're like almost vintage. I don't know. They're pretty freaking cute though. Oh, I like them. They look good on you. Look at you. I, I know. I, I know. But, you know, I don't need them. So here we are. Um, as far as scratches go, I didn't like see any. Let me make sure. Obviously, I wouldn't have bought them if there were scratches, right? Like, yeah. Right, There's Carmen. Some... Carmen says they're gorgeous. They're really nice. They are. Carmen, gorgeous. they're right up your alley. You love like a good chunky sunglass. These are really nice. I know they're really great. They're really great. The resale on them was like in the three hundreds, but we're not going to do that. So, what does Vadrian think? Like one. Adrian, how much do you want to do the sunglasses for? Like 150, 165. Like, what do you think? Is that crazy? Am I too nice? I just want them to go to a good home. Adrian says 150. Perfect. Let's, and shipping's included on my item. Oh, yeah. All of the, all of um, V stuff is including shipping. We should send them to a good home. Okay, and that's Something item number two, you guys. They're gorgeous. 10 out of 10. I'm trying to get on the live. Um, so I can see comments. Oh, wait, I think I just saw it. There I am. There's my face. Hip it. Oh my gosh, my face. <laughs> I see myself late. Okay, anyway, you get the case. They are, um, they don't sit like, they don't sit perfectly balanced like when they're on a shelf, but on your face, they're, they're even. Mm -hmm. You saw them almost. Like, I don't know if that's like part of the design or not, but just as an FYI, they sit fine. I don't know. And they're great if you have a small face, because I have a small face and I have to wear smaller sunglasses and they're like tight on me. Oh, so. for opposites. I have a really big one. Yeah. Like they're not going to like fall off your face, I guess, if you have a smaller head. Okay. Well, up next, we're going to go item number three. And I have these amazing Chloe boots. Look at these. They're in a dark Chloe brown. Boots? Yeah. Chloe boots out of Chloe nowhere. Boots. Look at that. I can't. And these are they are the, these are like the Paddington Chloe boots in Crap dark me. brown. These are in a size. What size are these? Thirty nine. Linda, I think that their systems are just slow. Sometimes they take a little bit to um, to like start populating the tracking on USPS. So, yeah, the the box was dropped off already, but it might like go up like sometime today or like later on tonight. Oh, there's V. She's in, oh, I was like V's in here. I was like, wait a minute. She's like in the live. Uh, Funny. Oh, Crime Solver wants to know if you have any Lululemon tonight. Yeah, I just I just need to know what sizes you want, and I can go pull pieces. I have about oh. five pieces. Okay, people are saying, oh, size thirty nine. Sarah the says, shoes. oh, these are the shoes. I typically need a forty in boots. <laughs> oh, I was like oh size thirty nine. What size is that Lululemon? That's like a European size. Yeah. Like so if anyone wants Lululemon. Um, let V know what size you're looking for, because she has a good selection. Yeah, and, like, maybe what kind of item. Yeah, because... if you want, like, yeah, what kind of item and what size. Hi, Peace, how are you? See okay, so, sorry, these are the boots, size 39. They're in fantastic condition. They're in a dark brown. They have brushed gold hardware. There has about a three-inch heel. And... Pretty much it. They're in really great shape. There's not too much wear on the soles of them. Or in the yeah, soles are in pretty good shape. Uh, leather is really nice. Pebbled leather. Yeah, there's excellent pre-love condition. I would, I'd probably say these are about like an eight point five out of ten. And that's gonna be item and number three. U.S. eight to eight. Eight to eight and a half U.S. Eight to eight and a half U.S. Usually. Yeah. So these are Chloe Paddington. Boots. Yeah, 39. 
Okay. Lulu, long sleeve. Okay. Lulu lemon, extra large top, long sleeve or sweatshirt. Yeah. Okay. These were eighty dollars, but we're gonna do a discount for you guys tonight, and we're gonna do uh, sixty-five for these guys. So sixty-five dollars for these Chloe boots. Item number three. Dang. Yeah. Okay. All right, okay. B, what do you have? I'm gonna do my favorite piece. Ooh, okay. Okay, these fit me. I'll even model them. Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> okay, I don't know if you guys know this, but everything that I'm selling this month is going into my Taylor Swift ticket fund because I do not <laughs> get spill my soda. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the loser. Okay, short story. I got pre-sale for Vegas. And I needed Seattle and I'm the idiot that like believed all of TikTok when they said, if you get pre-sale for one city, you're going to get it for both. And so when I got my pre-sale code for Vegas, I was like celebrating. But um, by that point in time, I knew I wasn't going to Vegas. So I had a couple friends that were interested in tickets to Vegas. So I just started buying tickets anyway, because I was going to sell them on StubHub. Um, if I could get any, if I could get any, mm -hmm. I got some, sold them to friends. And then the next day was the Capital One presale. I did get a Capital One credit card to get a presale code. I did not get tickets. <gasps> so then the, the public sale was canceled on Friday because Ticketmaster messed up. So basically... There's like so many Swifties, like 5% of people that wanted to go got tickets and we're all pretty much going to have to buy them on the secondhand market, which super sucks. They're super inflated. Yeah. So everything I'm selling this month is going into my little ticket fund. Um, and so I can buy the retro feet dress. If you know, you know. Um, but So these are very much giving reputation era. Okay. They're Gucci. Ooh. They're the Gucci New Ace, um, authenticated by Hadrian in the store. <laughs> Would not have purchased without. They have the serial number on the tongue. The Gucci made in Italy. Under it is the monogram GG um, insole. And they have the, um, like, what is that? Like, it's like mock croc, right? No, it's like the it's you know like a snake. About? Yeah, no, it's a boss snake. snake. Yeah. Yeah, it's in boss. They say Gucci. There is one small scuff, I think. Is it on this pair? There's my like minor scuffing. I took a magic eraser to them, cleaned them up real nice. Um one of the reasons one of the ways you know if these are real. Uh, the snake pair isn't really faked very often. It's a little bit harder to make with like this massive embroidered patch on it of a snake. I've done a lot of research on these shoes. <laughs> I have them listed high, but I'm going to offer you guys a deal. Um, they're, they run big. That's how you know they're real. So these are a men's seven, but they fit, they, they run big. And I'm a true nine and a half and they fit like perfect. So they would fit like nine, nine and a half. Mm -hmm. um, if you wear like an EU 40, that's like kind of perfect. And they're so freaking cute. They have they're like beautiful. the embroidered, it's an embroidered snake on the side. I know, I love them. Yeah, and then obviously the Gucci striping in here. And I love them. Yeah, I, mean, I, don't I think like the retail really of those is like what, 820 or something? Like almost a thousand dollars, right? Like eight fifty, I think. Yeah, eight fifty, something 50. like that. Yeah, yeah, and it's gone up. It went up. Mm -hmm. Um, because it was like seven fifty, and now it's eight fifty. So, I don't know. Three, three. I would say three. That's a good, okay. especially in that. I have them that's listed. really good. They're listed at six twenty five. So, whoa, it's it half table. off. Yes, three hundred. Three hundred. You guys, someone has to get these sneakers. Because I'm gonna put them on for you. They're gorgeous. Yeah, and they're so clean. Like 
Getting them this clean is insane. Yeah. You, you said there are men seven, yeah. though, right? Like the actual. There are men seven, seven, but they run big, so they fit like closer to a men's eight. Okay. And they'll tell you that on the, on the Gucci website, it says that they run big. Okay. Free foot content just now. <laughs> And oh, Kathleen. Kathleen, I'm sorry they're a little big. They're too big for you. Well, Kathleen, <laughs> hold your ponies, okay? Hi, Norma. <laughs> okay, so that was item number four, okay? Those snake um, Gucci sneakers for only three. That is such a deal, you guys. Like, that is Adelio. amazing. I know. I'm wild. V is going crazy tonight. Listen, it's it's Christmas. It's Black Friday or something. Yeah. Hit her in. Like trying to put on my boot. Oh, Carmen, they're too big for you too. No. Wait, I... Bummer. Do you have like a smaller oh. size too of something, right, V? Hang in there, kids. Hang in there. Um... Hedrian, how does the edge coat look? Oh, the edge coat is in... Good shape on this. No, like, cracking or anything on the edge coating of, uh, everybody of the, the bag. It's just, like, there's just, like, some slight rubbing on the corners, and it's missing that crossbody strap. And then the little glue mark right there. Otherwise, it's in really good shape. Right, DG House? DG House said that your sneakers are ideal. Uh, yeah. It's, like, Yeah. Like, you would pay that in a consignment store. Right? Yeah. No, it would be more, yeah. actually. I've seen those, like, for resale at, like, consignment stores, and they're, like, closer to 600-something. There's comps, like, all over online. They're, like, 560, 565. Yeah. And especially the size and the condition. Mm -hmm. I just don't have the dust bag or the box, which is what, like, because I got them in a consignment store, and they mm -hmm. didn't have that, so I was, like... <gasps> And that's always a bummer. I know. I know. I literally, you guys, I FaceTime Hadrian and I was like, are these real? I was like, <laughs> I was at Target. I remember the exact moment. I was like checking out at Target. Carmen's. Oh, Carmen, you're a size 7. Do I have a size? Oh, these are not a size 7. I have a size 39. In the 39. That's my size. No, I'm a 40. Wait, what happened, Vitrine? Did we have a email for someone's art studio? Oh, that was DG House, right? It was DG House's art studio? Yeah, DG House. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, my next item, since you were showing Gucci, I also have a pair of Gucci shoes in my what? hand. It has a box and the dust bags. It also has the original receipt, too, from New Marcus. But these are these beautiful black Gucci, like, loafer heels. Is that what you would call them? I don't exactly know what kind of style you would say these are. But they're oh, yeah. super cute. Look at this. Like a pump. A pump. It's a pump. It has it's like little, a Mary Jane pump almost. Right? It has little, these little tassely things in the front. They have the gold Gucci hardware on the sides. These are a two inch heel and these are a size 39. 39? So they're an eight, eight and a half? Yeah. Those are cute. Aren't they cute? Yeah. I think these are actually an eight. My mom tried them on. She said they're a little small and she's an eight and a half. So these are probably more fit like an eight. And Gucci they size. are in such great shape. They have very minimal wear on the bottom. Like it's just like, it's so nice. And they're it comes honestly, with the box, like, dust bag, Christmas. everything. They're definitely like, like, what is it, like dark academia or something? Yeah, I'm wearing those to Christmas Eve. Like, those are so cute. Right? I wish they were my size. I would just buy them off of you because I'm like that. What? I would be like, oh, forget Taylor. <laughs> no, you would never. I already know. <laughs> I know your obsession. I thought you were kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were just trying. You know, it's like. Nobody likes Taylor Swift that much. And I was like, no, 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 honey, you don't understand. <laughs> like, like I have loved Taylor for so long. 
I got made fun of. Like, it's embarrassing how long I've loved Taylor because I was in college when she got her first record deal. And my friend Nick works on Music Row. And when Taylor was younger, she, like, went door knocking on Music Row, like, begging for a record deal, like, trying to give her mixtape out. Mm -hmm. But she didn't play any instruments at the time except, like, barely piano. And everybody in Nashville was like, you need to learn to play guitar. So she got, like, so guitar she learned to play guitar. She learned to play guitar so that she could write more songs, like, better. And then she got a deal with Big Machine. And, man, I got made fun of so much. But I remember when Love Story came out and, like, going upstairs to Cass's room and being like, this is a bop. Sit down and listen right now. <laughs> Uh, and then everybody hated her in the rep era with the Kanye crap. But now everyone loves her, so. She deserves it. Hi, first curator. Um, oh, Kathleen, the shoes, they're not, like, pointed. They're they are just, like, kind of more rounded, but, like, a little bit more square. It's like an almond toe. Right? There you go. Mm -hmm. And these are going to be, well, they, we had them at 425 Well, let's lower it to 385 It's a little discount. And this comes with a box, receipt, dust bag, and everything. So that's item number five. Beautiful. All right. Oh my next. God. What do you got next? That is my life. Oh, for all, I see your Gucci shoes and I raise you Gucci shoes. Ah, <laughs> uh, amazing. <laughs> Okay, another pair of aces, same style. Um, the only thing about these, they have black laces instead of the white laces. I'm guessing it was like an aesthetic thing because I saw this stock image with the white laces and it was not as cute. The black do look I feel better. like I like the black better. They do look better. Um, and I think it came with both and they put the black on, but these ones are a six and a half men, which is like... A, they're tight on my foot, so I would say they're like an eight and a half, nine women's, um, or a like seven and a half men's. So, so they eight, are eight and a half women's. Yeah, like, they're the all over um, GG print, the monogram, like, and then these ones are the one with the scuff. So there's like a very small scuff. You see it on the blue. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Same price, 300 These ones actually resell for more, I think, but whatever. They're called, the, like, the Supreme Low Red or something. They made them in red, navy, and white. And these ones are the red. But, yeah. That is a deal. Okay, so those oh, are women's size 8.5. They're only $300, you guys. So that's item number five. I know, and I was thinking, like, these to the rep, like, these as rep era to the Taylor concert would be so genius, but they, like, do not match my dress at all. No. Not even a little bit. Mm -mm. So, here we are. Wait, did I put the wrong? Oh, no, those are supposed to be number six, I think. Way to go, dude. Vadrian. Were they number six? Yes. Hi, Vadrian. Who's Veronica? Sorry, guys. Okay, I fixed it. There you go. That's item number six. Got it. Okay. Hi, Veronica. How's everyone doing tonight? There's Okay, there's a bunch more of you guys in here now, so don't forget yeah. to enter the giveaway. Don't forget to enter the giveaway. That's right. The question is right at the top. What are you thankful for this year? I'm thankful for all of you guys. You guys have made my year, so thank you so much. And UV, thank you for being here tonight. I'm thankful for Adrian. Adrian's one of the realists. All right, up next, item number seven. Let's do... Okay, I have this Tory Burch. Like, this is the, I believe this is the Robinson Double Zip Satchel. And it's in this brown Safiano type That's leather. Cute. Is it cute? Mm -hmm. Gold hardware. It's in decent condition. I'm selling this one as an as-is bag, though, okay? So, it does have, like, a couple little marks. It has, like, a scuff right there on the front. Um, also, a little bit on the bottom. 
And the interior does have like a lot of staining in it. Like someone just spilled a bunch of stuff inside. But you should be able to clean it out. You just can't turn the, the lining inside out or anything. You just have to try to clean it inside. But the bag is still in really good shape otherwise. Um, the exterior leather is not in bad condition at all. The corners are... Yeah, there's like no like major rubbing on any of the corners. It just has like a few little scuffs on it, which I think will come out. Uh, let's check the zippers though really quickly. Okay, zipper works on top. It has two double zip pockets up top, so they both work really well. And the interior zipper works perfectly as well. And it has a magnetic snap up at the top as well. So this is our brown Tory Birch Robinson satchel. And cold hardware. And we're gonna do this one for just thirty dollars, you guys. So that's gonna be item number seven. Do -do -do. All right, up next, we got V. What you got? It's my turn. Oh, okay. Sister of a Down is calling it. Congratulations, Sister of a Down. Number seven yes. going to you. <laughs> Woo! Dang, you're like giving things away. I love it for you. Okay. Um, I see you a brown satchel and I raise you a brown satchel. Oh. This is a Coach Christy Carryall. Nice. It is in um, near immaculate condition. The measurements are, I think it's like nine. No, hold on. I'm gonna tell you. It is, okay, it's in centimeters. 26 centimeters, so is that like 12? It's like 12 or 13. Something like that, yeah. By like four, by like eight, six or eight. Anyways, it's, it's, it's like literally the mini version of the bag that I got. It even has a double zip up top, right? Yeah, it has double yeah, zip. Yeah, how cute. Okay, perfect. And then it opens, big pocket, very clean, double zip. It's got the Creed in there. Creed's right here. Nice. The little zipper pocket, full crossbody. You have your little logo toggle. Um, and it's like the embossed. It's like embossed. Though. Yeah, it's kind of like that Safiano style leather too. Yeah, mm -hmm. and I'll send it in a like a real world dust bag for you, so you get like a bag. Um, and I have it listed at three twenty five, but I'll do it for like one, like twenty five. Is that crazy? All right, one twenty five. That is one hundred. I don't even know. It looks like it's in really good shape. So. Oh, it's like perfect. Yeah, yeah. it looks like it's in really really good shape. It's very minimal wear. It's like out the box. It's from Neneve. Like, you know Neneve. Oh, Neneve's the best. She's crazy. She's crazy about things. So, it's gorgeous. I actually had a woman buy a black one that I had, and then she was like, I'll be back for that brown one, and she never came back for her. She was like, I'm coming back for you, babe, and she never did. Wait a minute. I think Gem Drops just bought something. She's calling item number... Wait, wait, what was that? Six? Isn't that yours? Is that mine? No, is that yours? That's V's. That's mine? yours, V. Those are the Gucci monogram print sneakers. Yay! Yay! Oh. Congratulations! Oh. Those are yours. Yeah, congrats! Yay! Yay. Hold on, we That's need so the... You're gonna love it. <laughs> Woo! Hey. Wait, did you give one to number seven? I need that noise for number seven. Oh, okay. <laughs> I always forget about these. They're so loud. They kind of freak me out. I love it. All right. But I was really excited. That's a good one. That's awesome. You're going to love those. Yeah. And V's information is right there, okay? So. Yeah, just send me an yeah. email. Yeah. All, um, that'll, it's also in the description box, like, all the info right there, too, so you can pay either Venmo or PayPal with V, so. Yeah. Just make sure if you go on Venmo to click business. Because people are always like, I can't find you. It's not personal. It's business. Like, I'm paying fees. It's like goods and services. So. Yeah. Business. Okay. Yeah, so Gem Drops. Yeah, Gem Drops was asking about how to do it. So, Gem Drops, all the info is down below in the description box as well to make it easier for you guys. I just didn't want to jumble up the screen since there's both of us mm -hmm. on here. So, everything's just down in the description. But, 
it, to make it easier for you too, if you just want to email V, she can also send you like a PayPal invoice too, like how we normally do it here. So, and that's the, all of V's prices are including shipping as well. Yeah. So my she's making shipping. it super easy for you guys. Yes. Yeah. I'm the difficult one. So sorry. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So congrats. That was such a good buy. I'm so excited. Okay. Number nine is that's up next. Nice. Oh, hi, Carmen's boyfriend. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. <laughs> okay, our next item for the night. What are we going to do? Um, oh, okay, let's do... I don't even know. Oh, let's do the Chanel backpack. What? So you check it out. Backpack? We got our Chanel backpack. This is the Spirit backpack in red. Check mm -hmm. her out. This man's just out here with a Chanel freaking backpack. Red lambskin leather, silver hardware, in fantastic condition. It has a back pocket right here. I think the only like flaw on the exterior is like the little dot right there. It's like a little bit lighter than the rest of the bag. But I will touch it up before I send it out to you, so you're not even going to see it. But I just want to let you know that I'm going to touch up that little spot. And then the interior is in really great condition as well. I think there's just one little pen mark right here. So there's just one tiny little dot right there of a pen mark. Otherwise, she is in fantastic condition. There's a zipper pocket in there, an open pocket underneath. And then we have the little key fob right there. And it has a drawstring up at the top also. And this will come with like a certificate of authenticity and all that good stuff. Uh, no dust bag or anything though. But we will just include another dust bag. It's just not going to be a Chanel one. And this is going to be item number nine. Red Chanel lambskin spirit backpack with silver hardware. And what are we going to discount this one for, Adrian? Wait, what do we have it at right now? Okay, so we had this at three thousand five hundred. We're gonna do three thousand two hundred. So that's gonna be the price of this one tonight for our red Chanel backpack. That's item number that's my nine. Favorite color red, like that cherry red. It's it looks like so pretty. It looks like Kool Aid red, cough drop red, like it's good red. Okay, so what do you got next, V? Um. I could do a belt bag. Yeah, we love a good belt bag. Okay, I have a Lululemon belt bag sold out. One of the hardest colors to get. This one resells for like 120. It's the opal white. I have not opened it because I don't want it to get dirty. Ooh. Um, and wait, what's the name of the color? It's opal white. Opal white. You can Google it. It's the everywhere belt bag. It's the small size, so like the running errand size. Um. Yeah, and I do it for like seventy five shipped. It resells for like one twenty. So like you know, I love you all seventy five if you want it. All right, I'm gonna pop a photo. I'm gonna pop up a photo of the belt bag so you guys can see it. That's perfect. Like really good. I also I also have it in black and the black large, but like I want to say those are both still available on the website, so I don't want to like rip anybody off if you can get it cheaper elsewhere so if it's not available though i got you i have the black and i have the black large all right she also has the black ones you guys so that's item number 10 okay that's 75 dollars brand new this is that photo of what it looks like that's and the one yeah okay perfect yay she wants it. Oh. <laughs> wait, wait where's my sound i'm so slow <laughs> Congrats, Katie. Yeah. You are yeah. a spoiled girl. Yes. Love it. You will love that. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, I love that. It's such a cute belt bag. You know, oh, my cousin actually came with one the other day, and I was like, oh, you got one of those? Yeah, if you guys want the black or the black large, let me know. Like, if it's sold out online for you, I can, um, I can do one for you. It's fine. All right, up next, we got item number... Oh, Brina, there you go. Hi, Brina. 
Hi. How are you? Also, hi, Jag. How's it going? All right, up next for number 11. What do I have for you guys? Let's do... Oh, someone's asking if the black one's new also. Yeah, they're all new. Oh. Do you want the small or the large? The large is big enough for like a, like a hobo wallet. The small is like the carry-all. Show them both. Oh, please. they're sold out. They're sold out. I'll do the same deal for all of them. Oh, they wow. Even the large? Yeah, let me grab them. Ooh, okay, you guys. Hear that? Um, Katie, yeah, um, all of these info is down below in the description box to make it easier. I just put our info, like our basic info up, so that way it's not like cluttering up the screen. But um, Katie, yeah, you, her Venmo is down below in the description box. Okay, here is the small, and here's the large. So you can see that the large- Oh, V, you there. just got another sale. Item number four, your Gucci <laughs> Snake sneakers. Are you serious? Yeah, Tara just called it. Congratulations, Tara. <laughs> Woo! Congrats. Oh, oh my gosh, Tara. she's so excited. Anyway, Get yeah, it. I have the small and I have the large. Um, actually, I should probably do the large at 80. So 75, 80. All right, so that's going to be number... Hold on. I'm going to do a number 11 Sorry. is going to be the smaller one. And then number 12 is going to be the larger one, okay? So the smaller one, that's going to be black, that's 75. And then number 12 is going to be the large one for 80, right? Okay. Yeah. Thank you, guys. I appreciate you so much for my Taylor Swift ticket button. <laughs> there you go. Okay, so that one is number 12. Yay. Also, okay. I'll miss you. <laughs> <laughs> You're... You have, you're immortalized wearing it in this video, so you at least you wore them in the video, and everyone can just watch. True. You should do another one. I need water. <laughs> uh, oh, Tara, that is going to be a great gift for your daughter. She's going to love them. Those oh shoes are fantastic. God. They're so nice. Okay. Um, all right, my turn. We're going to do item number 13. Um, Tara, it, you can either way. Yeah, you can email her at the end in case, but you can email her now too, just in case. Yeah, just shoot me an email. Yeah, I'll check just, it tonight. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's. What are you drinking now? Oh, just polar. Oh, just I'm like all interested. I'm almost I'm done with mine. For like water. <laughs> <laughs> I will tell you, Adrian. The more that I run, like your body is so smart. Tonight, I was waiting on my like soup and bagel. Uh huh. And I just wanted to start eating chips, and I was like. Oh my gosh, it's because when you run, you need more salt. And so it wasn't even about the chip, it was about the salt. And I also drink like way more water when I'm running. So it's like, I just need to remember how good this feels. <laughs> and like, never go back to not doing this again, because I feel so much better. Yeah. I don't know if I, I'll ever feel that way running, but... Well, I'm a millennial, and so are you, but I mean, I'm a millennial, and I have insane body dysmorphia just from, like, growing up with the most obscure, absurd beauty standard. But you're also right? a ballerina, so. Don't remind me. Um, <laughs> but, like, I just think of my entire formative years were very much, like, Brittany, Jessica, Christina, Mandy, like... And everyone was like a size two and gorgeous and like low rise jeans. And I just never fit the standard. And you know, just, <laughs> no, you're perfect. Dee. You get over it at a certain Listen. age, but you never lose that like battle with your body. You know what I mean? So I can remember how good this feels. <laughs> no, you got this fee. You're amazing. You, you need to teach me your ways because... <laughs> yeah, I don't know about that. All right, number 13, we got our Prada belt. Look at her. She's gorgeous. I'd rather take a nap. Same purse curator. Yes. <laughs> That's how I feel, too. Even though I'm not a good napper, I actually hate taking naps. But I probably hate running more. But is that weird to hate naps? I don't like, the, I don't like napping because it makes me more tired. But this is a black Prada belt. This is a size 32. 
She's beautiful. She's in really great shape. Um, hardware is really nice. It says Prada right here on the little belt loop right there, and then on the hardware right there. So. You just reminded me that I have a Max Mara belt that is so cute. Oh, show it next. Okay, we, I'm gonna go we back. love a Max Mara belt. Yeah, All right, so this is our Prada belt. This is a uh, size 32, and this is how much speed range? Okay, we had it at 90, but we're going to do this one for $80 tonight for our Prada belt. That's going to be number 13. Press creator, I'm a professional napper. Same, well, not same. I don't like napping, but I'm a professional at not running. Okay, we used to run a lot, though, when I was on the tennis team. I don't know how that happened. Oh, Linda. Well, that's different. But here's number 13. I was born in 1986, so you know what you mean. 1987? Yeah, name. Melissa. <gasps> Melissa, queen. All right, V, what do you have? This is number 14. Max Mara. Max Mara belt. Yes, it is a size... You know what? I have all the measurements on Posh. Let me grab it really fast. And then I can know what I, what I was selling it for and what I'm going to gift it to all of you for. LOL. <laughs> um, okay, hold on. Max Mara. Max Mara. Where is it? Okay. Not even there. Perfect. Whatever. Okay. Uh... <laughs> It's a size. It's from Neneve also. Nice. Neneve always has the best stuff. I miss her. I haven't oh. talked to her in forever. It's a medium. So it has the, like, the monogram, like, on the back. And then mm -hmm. it has this, like, I don't know. It's almost, like, Western. It's very, like, yeah. polo, preppy, um, like, snap detailing. It does not come undone. Let me see if I can find the measurements for you guys. I think I just don't have it under the correct, um, what the heck? Oh, I know why. Sorry, you guys. Poshmark is no, so okay. finicky. <laughs> Poshmark is so finicky. It's so annoying. Like with the, okay. All right. I have it at 79. So it measures 38 inches buckle to end. So it's probably 35 around to the the longest hole and a little bit shorter to the, I would say 33. Mm -hmm. so 35, 33. It's generally, this style is like a waist belt. So it has the M's, Max Mara M's. Um, and yeah, it's in great condition. Very boho in Italy. And retail is two twenty five. I have it at seventy nine, so I don't know, like fifty. Fifty. All right, fifty dollars. That's gonna be that's for our Max Mara belt. No, I think it's a good price. Max Mara is really <laughs> okay. No, that's good. I just want to make sure I do is that. Like that checkery part is that leather or is it fabric? Like what is? No, that? this is the woven, like the fabric. And woven the fabric. Okay, and the rest is leather. Uh huh. Yeah, and then okay. it has like the like. They're not snaps, but they're like made to look like snaps. Yeah, it's like studs, like flat studs. They're flat, yeah. Yeah. You know all the language. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Carmen, a size 32 is a medium. Yeah. Uh, it's a medium. Like for this belt, it would be like a medium. The belt is a medium. Yeah. Like, oh, wait, did you run Oh, no, belt? she was asking about mine. But yours is also a medium, right? Hold on. Yeah. I'm like, I'm going to tell you if it fits me on my waist. Okay, it does not fit me on my waist. And I'm like a 31. Mm -hmm. So, for reference, <laughs> 31 jeans, which I don't know if that sits up that high, but you know. Yeah. Anyway. Oh, Damn. Maria, here you have Maria. I'm sorry, Maria. This one's um, number 13. This is that Prada belt right here. So, it's a black leather, has a brass hardware. It says Prada right there on the bottom of the ring, and then also says it right there on That's pretty. the little belt. So, yeah, Maria was asking to see it again. So, there you go, Maria. It's a size 32. It, it, I could 
actually like kind of get it on my body so it's like <laughs> like it's really tight i'm like totally cinched but yeah so it would be like a like a medium or whatever but it's a size 32 still it still has space too to add holes in so if you want to add holes to this you can make it a little bit bigger too so and you can still make it also a little bit smaller if you needed to Okay, I still so, have your tiny Prada skirt. Oh, do you? Yeah. <laughs> I totally forgot about that thing. So little. <laughs> um, oh v, I just realized you're wearing a Yellowstone hoodie. I'm artist in residence. <gasps> oh my Ooh. gosh, that's awesome. Yeah, it's vintage. I got it from Tillish. If you know Tillish, she's a vintage seller. It's cute. Yeah. I like it. It's pretty cozy. Okay, my next <laughs> item is going to be... Another one. Let's see this guy right here. We got this super metallic gold Michael Kors satchel. It looks oh very similar to the Selma, but look at that. It's like reflective. It's so I tiny. think I saw it. Does the Selma come in purple? Like Selma comes in like every color, so. I yeah. got it in a thread up bag box. Oh, did you? Yes, and it was like perfect. I was like, why is this in here? I was very confused. Yeah, this guy is in really good condition. We have a little charm right here as well, a little lock charm. It does have also a crossbody strap, or no, yeah. Crossbody strap is still wrapped up, so I didn't want to open it up, but it does have the crossbody strap. Interior is also lined in leather as well. It's a tan leather. There's just one interior pocket inside of there, and there also is one back pocket right there. And yeah, this bag is pretty much in like new condition. Even the crossbody strap is still wrapped up. And it does come with the original cards and um, thing as well, like the little care booklet. Retail price was $428 for this bag. They're not messing and it around. zips across the top. And it has little feet on the bottom too, which is always really nice. We appreciate the feet. And this is going to be item number 14, our gold snake embossed Michael Kors satchel. And this one is going to be... Okay, we're going to do this one for $75. This one's in like new condition. That's going to be number 14. $75. That's a deal. Deal. All right. Up next, we got number 15 from V. What do you got, V? Um, just a little basic. This is a Urban Outfitters. It's new a tag, so it makes a great gift, especially if you have a child. It's a little bucket bag with Ew. like an acrylic like tortoise handle, and then it also has like a crossbody strap. It's vegan, like suede, but it's super soft. It has a little snap closure, like lots of room in here. Um, oh, and it has a a pouch another pouch cute friend. is it removable yeah i think so last i checked it was is it yes it's removable it has a little clip it's his removable retail 44 we'll just do it for 20. nice worth it great gift i think it's adorable it's very boho it's very like the kids call this like cottage core boho three people <laughs> Free people. Yeah, all the cores. <laughs> yeah. I just love this handle, the acrylic. It's so I like fun. the handle a lot too. It's really cute. It's so fun. Yeah, it's like white and white and brown acrylic. And this is so soft. It, it literally Oh Madame like Goomba's cool. calling it. Number 15 going to Madame hey. Goomba. Congrats, Madame Goomba. Also, hi Madame Goomba, how are you? <laughs> Go off, Queen. Yay. Thank you. All right. We'll love it, madame. <laughs> Number 16. What do I have for you guys? Let's One do... Uh, oh, okay. These are size 40. They fit like a size 8.5. And, and these are some Chanel heels. So cute. They're like little boots, like little like ankle boots, right? Chanel heels in a black lambskin, it's like an uh, aged lambskin leather. 
Look at the heels on these. They are kind of major. This is how those look right there. Look at they're so cool. They kind of like have like a little spirally look going down. And it has little CC logos on the sides. And they zip uh, down like this. And there's the interior. Hi, Bubble! Alright, so these are, they're in really good condition. They actually don't have like too much wear at all. Like the bottoms still look really, really good. And the heels are in great shape. Uh, these are size 40. Again, they fit like a size 8.5. And, and the heel height is, let me check really quick. Heel height is the four and a half inches. Hi, Terry. How are you? Happy Thanksgiving to you, too. Hi, Veronica. All right, so this is our black Chanel um, ankle boots, size 40, fits like size 8.5 with 4.5. Okay, and we're doing these guys for 400 if anyone's interested. That is item number 16. Oh, you guys, my mom said the same thing about wearing these boots because I had her try them on. And she is like, I cannot okay. walk with these. I'm going to break my ankles. <laughs> but <laughs> they look really good. She's like, these are sitting shoes. You just sit in these. <laughs> these are going to meet celebrity shoes. These are comedy club shoes. Exactly. This is like a going okay. out to dinner just from the, from the car to the table. And you just sit there for the whole night shoes. My grandma would be like, these are not concert shoes. These are theater shoes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay, wait, what do I miss that? Okay. All right, what do you got for us, V? One sec, let me... Um, okay. Oh, Madame Goomba, her info is in the description box down below. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. I know, I think Madame just came in, so... Yeah, Madame Goomba, down below in the description box, um, has her, I her, her, her information down there, so... And if you want her to send you, like, a PayPal invoice, like I normally do, just send her an email and she'll send it to you. I'm going to have to figure that out because I never send invoices, but I can, I'll figure it out. I'll help you. <laughs> I do almost everything exclusively on Venmo business because of my like ID service. So mm -hmm. it's just like a couple bucks here and there. I don't accept a ton of money on PayPal, but I, I get a lot of money on PayPal from platforms. So we, we can figure it out. We can figure it out. Okay. This is a, um, oh, sorry. You like went quiet. I think I have the name. Okay, this is the gallery tote bag from Coach. It's tweed, if you can see it. It's got like white, pink, orange, black. It has like patent handles. The handles look really good. The zipper comes completely open and you can even like separate the zipper and then put it back on so it will like open completely up for you. Nice, like a jacket. Uh, huh? <laughs> like a jacket. Like a jacket, exactly. The creeds are here. It has some um, like pen marks and stuff on the inside. It, somebody put like a close or a safety pin and there's like a little hole. I don't know why they did that. That's stupid, but it's inside of the zipper pocket. Um, it's lined, you know, it's got a lot of space, but yeah, some pen marks. Um, but the exterior looks really nice. The tweed is in good shape and the patent is good. Like I'm not seeing a lot of scuffs or anything. Um, it's just adorable. If you love coach, it's like, a, you know, it's coach. Um, and I'll let Vadrian price it because I trust Vadrian. Vadrian, what would we do with this tweed coach? <laughs> <laughs> and it says coach right here on the little, um, plate. It's so cute. Vadrian says 60. Is that okay? Um, that seems high. Uh, let's go door. Let's do... Let's go 50. 50 dollars. Yeah, because I have it listed at... I have it listed at 69, so that seems high. Oh, uh, Vadrian was just reading your mind, that's why. Vadrian <laughs> <laughs> was reading my mind. Alright, so that's number 17. And <laughs> first curator says it looks like a repurposed oh. Chanel jacket. It loves it. Uh, Kathleen yeah, looks like, wait, Kathleen, just... are you calling it? Congratulations, Kathleen. I think, wait, Kathleen, okay, I just want to make sure. Kathleen. Tell yeah. us the item number really quick. The just... condition of it, 
The condition of the inside is why I'm like, no, we can't go higher. <laughs> like, <laughs> but it's good. You can hide it. All right, I'm just waiting to Love make sure it. Kathleen's calling that one just really quickly. Because oh, I, yeah, exactly. I don't think she put an item number, so. Just want to make she said nine. Sometimes people accidentally press the button, so. And, like, the timing is off, so it's like it could have been earlier. Yeah. And I have this one instead of the one I bought earlier. What one did she buy earlier? Oh, Kathleen, no, I'm sorry. Ka um, V... V and our, our sales are separate, Kathleen. Yeah, they're separate. Yeah, I'm sorry. Bing, bing, bing. Whatever works out, works out. I'm not, it's fine. Um, Kathleen, for that one, yeah, uh, V's information is down below, but it's also on the screen, so you can send her an email right there. But her yeah. PayPal and her Venmo are in the description box of this video. Yeah. But Kathleen, if you want to cancel the bag you bought from us earlier, we can do that too. That's no problem. Adrian, you're too nice. <laughs> it's fine. Alright. That's item number 17 though, right Kathleen? <laughs> so congratulations. <laughs> Woo! Yay! I love the clapping. I love I the clapping. It's a little bit less loud than the other one. So. <laughs> I love the other one. <laughs> All right, so number 18 is, let's do, okay, I have this Chanel shirt, like a black, <coughs> and I'm going to give you guys a really good deal on this one, but it's really pretty, this is in a size, it's like a size small, the number size on here is a size 34, but it fits like a size small. And it's this beautiful, like, white knit blouse. Really pretty. And it kind of has, like, a little mini peplum at the very bottom, too. And then these little details on the front right here and the back. Looks kind of like a crochet. They're really nice. Here's the back. The only thing is the Chanel tag on top has been removed. But it has a little Chanel that? button on... The bottom right here. Oops, there you go. And then all the t inner tags are still in here. So there's these size tag and everything. And it even has a little, um, what is that called? The barcode is right there too. And it's really pretty. It's a good like layering piece too, I feel like. It'd be what really size is it? Again. The dog is small? Hmm? Is it a small? Yeah, it's a size small. So freaking It's cute. a size 34. Okay, so Ugh. our white Chanel knit blouse. How much is this, Adrian? Okay, we're gonna do this one for two twenty-five. Oh, Madame said she sent you the Venmo. Yeah, Maybe. if you guys could just Perfect. email me shipping info, that'd be great. Yeah, just email her your shipping info, Madame Goomba, please, and thank you. Please, thank you so much. Happy early Thanksgiving to you too, Ashley. Oh, it's no worries, Kathleen. All right. Uh, so what do you got, V? Okay, I have a coach. Hold no. on. It's a cute coach. I'm trying to get you. Okay, it's the Legacy. I always have to consult my photos to make sure I don't miss anything. The Legacy Ergo in burnished leather. It's a shoulder tote. You all see this? Yes. Uh huh. It's lined with the striped fabric. There's your creed. I believe, well, it has like a key clip. I don't think anything was ever on this. I think this is just like for your keys. There's like one pen mark in the inside, but the material's really nice. It's not like, it's like that striped satin. Okay, cute. Fabric. Oh, I think the clips yeah. are so you can clip the top together. Like the You're whole so place. right. How do you know this? <laughs> You're insane. He's right. It's he can clip the top together. It's embarrassing. It's okay. It's bags are bag. my thing, so. I don't even know about my own freaking bag. <laughs> <laughs> but you can definitely put your keys on there too. It's okay. 
interior zipping pocket. Um, it's 11 and a half by 14 by five. And then it has just a couple exterior marks on it. If I were Hadrian, I could get them like fixed for you, but they're small. There's the bottom, back, sides. And it has the turn lock on the front. So cute. I love a turn lock. Mm -hmm. That's the move. Super nice. Very boho aesthetic. Okay, it's listed at um, 225, but whatever Hadrian, Vadrian says is a go. So. All right, Vadrian, how much is this guy? Whatever Vadrian says, it's a go. Vadrian says 85. Go. All right, $85. That's item number 19. <laughs> All right, and that's our coach, Legacy Ergo in burnished leather. All right. Uh, let's go on to number 20. What do we have? What do we have? We're already on 20? Yeah. I feel like we just started. I know. It's only 9 o'clock. We're making really I good time. Show, Usually, I'm only at, like, show. number 10 right now, so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Seven. Oh, it's because I had the multiple belt bags. I was like, how do Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. V still has those belt bags, you guys. So Yeah, if you want small they are black beautiful. or large black. Small black or large black. I got you. They are both sold out. I just checked. I doubt they restock before Christmas because Lulu is... They're going to do their Black Friday sale this week and usually... With their Black Friday sale, they re-upload anything they have, like, one of left mm -hmm. over, like, one to a hundred units of something. So you'll see the most random stuff, but they don't usually restock through the end of the year. Now is when they, like, start just trying to, like, close out, and then they'll uh -huh. do a big drop in January, so. Uh, you know everything about Lulu. I mean, and you know everything about bags, including the <laughs> Lip that would close the bag. <laughs> I'm an idiot. All right, up next, this is a Kate Spade. Um, this is kind of like a wallet clutch pouch. I don't even know exactly what to call it. Wristlet. It's in this black pebbled leather, and it has light gold hardware. We have the wristlet right here. It's attached to the zipper pull. So it went like that. Here's the interior. It has just three card slots. And yeah, you can use it as a pouch or as a wallet. Your phone does fit inside. I have the largest um, iPhone, so fits in there beautifully. And you're on the go. So this is gonna be item number 20. This is in like new condition. This is our black, let's call it the black domed wallet clutch bracelet. Kate Spade with light gold hardware. And we're going to do this one for $40. And that's going to be item number 20. Ooh, are you going to do the mug next or the cup? V? Yeah. All right. Moving that's number into the 20. cup territory. Uh oh. Okay, let's see what you got. Okay. They're all venti. I'll just do one at a time because. Okay, um, this one will be 45 Chipped. So this is the Bejeweled Pink Iridescent Venti Cup. This is, okay, so you guys should know that like I buy these cups and I hold them until they hit like $100 on Amazon. So you're not going to be able to find any of these so, because they're not recent. They're like I've been holding. So um, this is the Bejeweled. It's like the flat jewels and it's in a pink iridescent. It's gorgeous. It's so pretty. Yeah, and it has the spiral straw. So. I like the For the collector in your life, $45. For the collector in your life. <laughs> oh my gosh, how is my phone already at 20%? That makes no oh, sense. Oh, is it already dying? It's uh -oh. fine. I have a charger right here. Okay, yeah. perfect. Okay, so that was 21, you guys. That was $45 for the Bejeweled Starbucks Iridescent Venti Cup. Very so nice. So Bejeweled when I walk in the room. I can start the <laughs> <summer. laughs> Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, up next, I have... Let's do... 
another, I have another Rebecca Minkoff, or I don't know Rebecca Minkoff, Tory Burch. So this is a Tory Burch little, it's like a straw shoulder bag. And it's in like this natural woven fiber. And then it has like a champagne gold leather trim and light gold hardware. It has a double strap, but it actually extends. You can wear this as a crossbody or as a shoulder bag. It has this fun tassel detail right there on the front. The bottom is in that same champagne gold. There are some marks though on the bottom. Can you see that? There's like some light marks along the bottom, mm -hmm. but nothing crazy. The shimmer uh, hides. Hmm? The shimmer hides them. I know, it does, yeah. So you don't really see it. Like, you kind of have to like, look at it at a certain angle to see them. But uh, that's the bottom. There's a little bit of like discoloration on some of the corners. But the, uh, the woven fiber is still intact. Like, it's not like breaking through or anything. There's just a little bit of discoloration on the bottom corners. And when you open it up, the interior is in decent shape there's just like very minimal like markings there's like a couple little dots right there um and a little thing right there on the interior there's a middle zipper compartment which looks like that there's a, some very light discoloration at the very bottom and there's a zipper pocket on the back, and then three on the other side. Um, yeah, that's this guy right here. This is gonna be item number 22. Oh my gosh, I know, and more double sales. All right, so this is our Tory Burch uh, natural woven fiber uh, shoulder. Wait, double sales? What does she mean? With two, pe oh, with two people. Oh, <laughs> I was like, something sold twice? With... Hi! Hagen, uh, leather trim, and gold hardware. I don't know how much this is, Peter. $900. Nah, we're going to do this one for 45 bucks. All right, so that's going to be item number 22, our Tory Burch for $45. All right, what do you got next, Pete? Okay, I love this one. We have in our tumbler. Also 45, this one is the Frosted Jelly Pink. So mm -hmm. it's got the studs, it's completely studded, but like they're jelly, it almost looks like honeycomb. And they're all brand new, brand new. Got your pink straw. So freaking cute. Love it, it's like Frosted Jelly. Pretty, oh, Purse Creators Con 22. That's first created. That's the Tory Burch. Yay! Let's go. I don't know about you, but I'm feeling 22. Okay. Last <laughs> queen. He's a real fan. You get number 22. That's the second time I've said that tonight. <laughs> Wait, that how your cup was 45? How much was 45. it? 45. 45. All right. 45 yeah, hours. That's number 23. You guys. When I ship these, I have to like pad them and then put them in a special box and like, it's a whole thing, so. Yeah. It's like a whole thing to ensure they don't break. <laughs> All Ooh. Right. I sent two to Hadrian one time, he can tell you. Yeah, she does a good job, guys. She's the best. Delighted. Those I sent cups. Thank you. Okay. Addicted. I'm addicted to Starbucks cups. I can't help. They're so fun. I know. I eat them every day. <laughs> All right. Um, okay. So 24 is your up turn. Next. What do I have? What am I gonna do? Okay. Let's. Uh, what do I have around me? I have so much stuff. I don't even know what to show. Okay. Let's do. I need more pouches. Pouches? Any more pouches? Um, I can think of what I have. Pouches, pouches. <laughs> I have this. Uh, this is a coach pouch, like a pouch wristlet. It's in. It's like a Safiano leather, but it's a patent Safiano. So like, it literally looks like it's glittering, but that's just like the leather. It doesn't look. I look like I'm glittering. Yeah, you're like a Twilight vampire. 
Yeah. Yeah. You were like, wait a minute, what? Yeah. <laughs> and what was it? It's in a brushed brass hardware. We have the zipper up top, which is attached to the, uh, to the wristlet. And the interior uh, just has six built-in card slots. And then we got a slip pocket behind it. And then this is a pocket in the front. You squeeze the hardware together, lift this up, and you have a pocket right there. And in a size, or for a size comparison with the phone, that's how it looks. And this dual totally fits inside. It's a great wristlet. That's number 22. This is, or 24, our black Safiano patent coach wristlet with brushed brass hardware. And this one's going to be $75. This one is in like new condition. So that's number 24. All right, V, what do we have? 25. Oh my gosh, I haven't read one of these bios in so long. Are you ready? Yeah. Maya. She's fresh, cool, with a hint of sweet. That's how all the Malos describe Maya. This marvelous Malo is the best one to know if you need a helping hand. She'll give you a little tough love, but always knows the right things to say to turn your thought, your frown upside down. It's Maya the mint chocolate chip ice cream. Squish. That's so cute. Look at her. The five, she's five inches. Perfect little stocking stuffer. So Maya. And how much uh, are we doing that one for? 15, 15. shipped. This oh. one's a Learning Express exclusive, so. Ooh. She's a little bit. Oh, V, Crime Solver is asking you to hold up the two black belt bags, please. Yeah. Oh, let so, me actually get the what? What is the name of the belt? Uh, the bags again? They're the the everyday belt bag. Everyday hologram. Yeah. So oh, this so is they're, the, they're not in the bag, so you can see them. Okay, never mind. I was gonna get This is the large, and this is the small. They're about an inch. It's an inch all the way around. Wait, let me see. Mm -hmm. This is not a great example, but here's the white on the black, so you can like see it's about an inch. Mm-hmm. All the way around. Um, I prefer the large, but people love the standard. So, wait. Yeah, this is the standard. This is the large. Ooh. And the standard size is 75. That's item number... Um, I don't remember the number. Adrian, was that number... Okay, yeah, the small one was 11 and the big one was number 12. So 75 and 80. $5 difference. $5 difference for the two. Yeah, and this is the... And that's... This is Maya. Maya. So cute. So soft, little squish. Brand new. Just took her out of the packaging. Uh, mm -hmm. Dawn says she has the large one and she loves it. Maya or the bag? The bag. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine she's like, Maya. <laughs> Maya, I have the large Maya. <laughs> Imagine. Yeah, I love the large too. Mm -hmm. All right, let's do 26. Right oh, yeah, no worries. Okay. Um, oh, Dawn, this one's for you. Hold on, where is she? Where did I put her? All right, Dawn. So... This is our tan Chanel crossbody. She is gorgeous. With the crossbody strap, silver hardware, it has a turn lock right here. No, it's fine. No, it's okay. And then here's the inside. There's one zipper pocket right there. And this is my favorite part. There's a zipper in the back. So really, really cute bag. It's a cross body. So it looks like this. And you have it on. Really nice. Um, oh, Crime Solver. Crime Solver is calling the large one V in black. So, congratulations! Let's go! Woo! I'm putting it in my sold pile. 
Okay. Oh. Okay, so this Chanel, this is our tan Chanel flat bag with silver hardware. Congrats, and how much was this on Vadrian? I love that we have to ask Vadrian. Like, I, know. Hey, Vadrian. I don't remember anything. <laughs> Okay, this one is 2450 That's item number 26. I love it. I love it. Okay. I love it. I'm obsessed. I'm like, I don't know where to go to next. What are you going to show Should us? Should I go back to cups? Whatever you want. Whatever and Don want. calling it. Congratulations, Don. Oh, Yay! Don. Again, the Chanel bag. Woo! Wait, we need the air. <laughs> Congratulations, Dawn! Let's go! Yay! Woo! She's beautiful. You're gonna love her. Oh my gosh! Go off, Dawn! Yay! Yes. Oh my gosh! I'm jealous. Okay. Um, this is the Venti studded. It's the rock stud in like the neon pink. With it has like the line, uh, the yellow straw. Oh. And it's studded. Starbucks. I know it's so nice. With. The Venti, big one, the big end. If you have never held the studded cup in your hand and like understood how satisfying it is because you have like a grip on the cup, it's just, it's just freaking satisfying. And you sit there and you're like this all day. <laughs> Please, it's the best. You know, I know. I have a. I have too I, many of them. So, Hadrian and I both have this cup. I got it for him last year. And Vadrian has Yeah. It. We all, I we all use this triplets. every week. <laughs> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yay. Okay, so that's going to be item number 27. And it's $45, you guys. The question is, do you want the orange one before I go in the... <sighs> I don't know. I'm trying to think about it. How do you think about it? Mm -hmm. <gasps> No, you know I want that one. Stop it. <laughs> no, 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 she's the, the, the squish my love, Adrian. It's a squish. Yeah, it was a french fry squish. I really it's want it. It's funny. Adrian's wanted this since, like, last year. <laughs> and I finally got one today. One of mine came back from Warehouse. Look at it. It's so cute. <laughs> Oh Guess what God. his name is? It's my favorite. What is it, Tommy? Lloyd. <laughs> <laughs> it's so cute. I love that it says fries. Like you didn't know what it was. Like, yeah, right. It's so cute, though. I need that. Yeah. Fries. He liked orange. He did say he liked orange. Have you said he liked orange? He yeah, has. Do love orange? But. Oh, well, listen, ladies and gentlemen, I like an orange Hermes Birkin. <laughs> okay. At this point, I'm like, I'll take a Kelly. I'm like, I'll take a fake one. <laughs> no, no, I won't. Don't do that. I don't like to buy fakes of anything because, like, it's the same reason I don't like to buy really anything generic. I want everything I buy to have some form of resale value if I ever get tired of it. That's true. Yeah. So that's why I'm like, I don't like to buy anything generic, even though it sucks. Like up front, like it's more expensive, but it's like, okay, at least it holds some kind of value down the line. Hannah says the fries you can carry inside your bag without getting greased everywhere. <laughs> oh my gosh, <laughs> oh imagine, imagine, imagine. I just carried in my bag everywhere I go. That'd be so Your cute. fries in your little crossbody. Stop. Oh my gosh. You know what's so funny? My little my sister, she has um a little Polly Pocket that she carries with her everywhere she goes. She always has it inside her bag. Oh my god. A little That's Polly Pocket from our childhood. There's the 1993 Bluebird Polly Pocket in the heart shape, the the like magenta heart shape with the little dog. That is on my bolo list of like things from my childhood I miss, as well as the rectangular light pink compact that has like the swimming pool in it. Oh, I feel like my sister has both of those. 
When I tell y'all that I like negotiated with people on Mercari like over and over and nobody would give me a deal, I wanted to sob. I have to, I, I like found um, like all of her old Polly Pockets from our childhood that my mom kept in a box. And I put them in the sto- in our storage unit. So I'm gonna have to look no. inside. And see. Oh my gosh, Dawn, it's no problem. It's such a beautiful bag. You're gonna love it. Oh my gosh, Dawn, you're gonna lose it. All right, um, 28, what do we have? What am I going to do for 28? You guys, Adrian has so many bags. It's, like, embarrassing. Like, it's very embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> very embarrassing. It's a, my, my, aunt, my aunt just called. Um, wait, wait. Oh, did somebody call something? No, 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 no. No, my oh. aunt called, like, earlier when we were having dinner. And then she was, like, she was calling to say she was so excited to come over for Thanksgiving. And she was, like, hey, Adrian, I hope you're ready with all your, your bags because I want to go through all of them. And I was just like, oh, my gosh. Do you guys remember last year during Hadrian's Black Friday sale when he did, like, all those, like, 10 20 $30 bags because he had, like, a closet? And do you remember somebody was like, do you have any more backpacks? And you literally went to the closet and found, like, eight can-can backpacks. <laughs> like, who is just sitting on eight can-can backpacks? I forgot that I had them. And then when they said backpacks, I was like, wait a minute, I have backpacks. That was painful to watch. I was like... Huh? <laughs> I was like, those would have been listed the minute they got home. They'd be gone. Like, it'd be over. <laughs> oh my gosh, I should have just sent them to you. Um, what do I have? I, I don't even know what to show anymore. I'm just like... <laughs> I that little pink coach bag you sent to me. I don't have very much of your stuff left. I think I have, like, the birdies, the docks, which surprises me on both of those, and then, like, four articles of clothing. But everything oh, else is gone. Almost gone. Yeah, like paid you out, cashed you outside. All right, this is our next Ooh. item. This is our reversible Saint Laurent tote bag. And it's in this beautiful gray leather on one side. And you guys already know the inside or the other side. The turn inside out is in black suede. I feel like this is the perfect time of year too for this bag, especially with the suede part. I feel like suede is such like a winter, well, even it is kind of like a summer leather too, but it depends on the color, yeah. right? That's like a school bag too. I mean, if you're bougie like me, like college girl bag, that's that's a class bag. Right? I was watching like everything. this, I was watching this TikTok and this girl was like, yeah, like she went to like such a bougie school, like all the girls at school like carried Birkins at school bags. Mm-hmm. And she went to school like in like, I don't remember, like, uh, I don't remember, Switzerland, I think. And she only had, like, a YSL bag, and she said she felt really poor. <laughs> and uh. I was like, what? But this is um, number 28. It also does have a removable little pouch right here, and then it comes with the dust bag as well. And this has gold hardware. It has the little studs on both sides of the bag. Uh, the suede part is in really great shape. The gray leather side does have like minimal rubbing on the bottom corners, um, which I'll show you right now. It doesn't like, it's not too bad, but it does have like slight rubbing on the bottom four corners. Birkins, are you right and Birkins at school bags. It's crazy. Okay, so this yeah, is our gray. But Birkin, she wore them, she used her bag like she just carried that thing around like it was. Oh, Jane Birkin, yeah. Yeah, she didn't care. Okay, I have to, like, plug in my phone. This is going to be interesting. Okay. Um, we're going to do this one for only four fifty. If anyone's interested in this, guys, it's going to be number 28. That's our YSL reversible tote. For four hundred and fifty dollars, that's number Holy twenty-eight. Holy cow! Giving it away. Okay, is that plugged in? Oh, yep. We got power. I got the power. <laughs> All right, V. What do you got next? Um. Okay, let's do a little squish you can clip on your bag. Okay. <gasps> great Ooh, squish clip. Okay. Or a great clip on your bag. I have to think like. I don't know, like that. I'll do these for, I have two styles, but I'll do them for, like, 
eleven dollars. Okay, this is Blake, and he's a bunny, and he has stars on his belly and a little bow tie, and it's a clip. That's so cute. Wait, is it what kind of animal is that? What did you say? It was a bunny. It's a bunny. Okay. It's a rabbit. His name is Blake, but could you imagine? Look. Watch, you guys. This is so camp. This is so camp. Are you kidding me? Stop. <laughs> I mean, I would do it anyway, but it is camp. <laughs> That's cute, though. We do love a little bag charm, for sure. Little kids with, like, a bag charm on their backpack, please. Yeah, I love his little star belly. It's giving Taylor Swift midnights, so... <laughs> He said that was eleven dollars shipped, right? Yeah. Perfect. All right, so that's number twenty nine. That's eleven dollars. He loves to dress up. This is so on brand. He loves to dress up. He, you can find. Oh, it's a girl. You can find her in all different costumes, especially on playdates with her friend Ava. She's always in character, whether on ship as a pirate, on land as a princess, or at sea as a mermaid. Stop. Blake. Like Blake Lively. We love her. She's so freaking cute. Are you kidding me? By the way, Hadrian is the only person, the only person in the resale world, in my world, that is allowed to address items with pronouns. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're eating that. He is. <laughs> I don't care. Every time I go on live auctions and I'm like, she is, it's, I'm out. I'm out. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It's a no for me, dog. <laughs> I can't help it. I don't know what's wrong with me. No, every, you're perfect. Okay. Ooh. Um. Up next. Oh, you know, um, what's her face? Hannah, I saw your message, like, right before we started the live. And I know you, um, you asked about the drop length for the strap on this bag and I have to show you this bag too because I feel like you'd really enjoy it because it's really funny because it's so cool like I've never seen a light up bag before and just to like hold one in my hands okay hold on I want to measure the longest length for you hmm I'm just I'm just doing what you do just arranging them in my little house <laughs> Uh, the drop length is about 21 inches, Hannah, but, uh, V, what? let me show you this, because this is so cool. What is it? Okay, do you see this? I'm looking. Shut your mouth. What? Because you're a sky, you're a sky full of stars, I think that's a... It's so cool. It like, what is that? It's a Michael Kors light up bag. It has like a little like fireworks thing, rainbow fireworks thing in the middle. And you can like kind of change like how much you want it to like light up. Baby, it has a little battery pack inside. Work. Isn't that so cool? Right? The only other time I've seen a bag like this is like, I think I saw like a Chanel bag that had like a little light up thing in the inside. But yeah, it's so. Cool. And I think Louis Vuitton has one too, right? But yeah. Listen, what's her face? Michael Kors. <laughs> what's her face? <laughs> but it's so cute. It's Michael Kors. It's brand new. Uh, it still has like part of the strap was still wrapped up. And then it has like the original like little tag still attached and everything. And, has paper on the hardware. Uh, but yeah, so. Oh, the Balenciaga one is so cool. And. Okay, this is our black light up Michael Kors crossbody camera bag with gold hardware. And how much is this feeder? All right, this one was $95. And that's item number 30. Cause baby, you're a firework. Yeah. That's what this reminds me of. It's like a. Baby, you're a firework. Oh! Ann's calling it. Congrats, Ann. Where's my gavel? Yes, Ann. Oh. That was so cute. 
That was the coolest purse I've ever seen in a minute. Okay. Wait, we need the... <laughs> Alright. Oh, I'm sorry, Maria. <gasps> this one's already claimed. Sorry, and was man. quick. She was quick with it. Okay. Good job, man. I love that for you. Watching the stream is delayed. It's funny. Oh, I know. How delayed is it for you? Like, probably 15 seconds. Oh, okay. Just... That's actually not bad. Sometimes it's like a 45 seconds a minute. Yeah. And everyone's okay. like, the chat is like so quick. And I'm like... <laughs> okay, Madame Gooba said it was cute. Um, this is Tahoe. It looks like a bear. I mean, it's technically a Tasmanian devil, but it looks like a bear. Wait, what's so. his name? Tahoe. Tahoe? T A J O, yeah, Tahoe. It's a little black bear. Um, it's seven and a half inches. So cute. Um, I'll just I'll do it for eleven too. I don't care. Like it's so cute. Okay. Mm hmm. It's so cute. It's a little bear. It's, like, it's so freaking cute. Have you ever? If you've never held a squishmallow, like okay, let me put it this way. I stopped buying squishmallows, so all of these are like out of production. So the old Squishmallows are so soft compared to the new Squishmallows. Really? Like they changed the filling. Yeah. Yeah, the filling changed and they got more expensive. It's so annoying, but I know. I know. Wait, is the, French fry the old, is, the, is the French fry like the old Squish or the new Squish? Old, yeah, it's old. They're all old. I haven't bought a Squish in like, nine months oh so, wow yeah, you used I to buy a, them like every other day i know i well i just you like invented squishmallows <laughs> i just have a warehouse coming back from amazon so like a lot mm. of these were in warehouse so they've been in a bag i just opened them like they, this is the first hands that little baho here has touched so he's so cute and how much okay. is tahoe 11 11 dollars Tahoe, love it. All right. Yeah. Oh, and the dimensions for the Michael Kors bag, I typed them out, so right there. So 8.5 by 2.5 by 5.5. Mine! Go, Goomba! Yes! Woo! I'm putting him with your bag. Do you only have one? Because uh, I only have one. Oh, uh, Rosa wanted one, too. Wait, who got it first? Let's see. Oh, you know what? Rosa actually called that one right before Madame Goomba. Right here. I'm not seeing comments. I'm like missing. My, I put up the screenshot too, so. There wow. you go. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Madame Goomba. Rosa called that one. Like literally like everything just populated at once. But Rosa's was Don't right worry. There. I have more squish. <laughs> She's the queen of squish. Of old squish. <laughs> There's more squish coming! Of the superior vintage squish. <laughs> the superior squish. Yeah. <gasps> oh, squish. I'm sad I only have one of Baho. I love him. Or Tahoe. Oh, but someone wants... Oh my gosh, do you only have one of the fries? I only have one fry. Uh, okay, just give it... Give it... Give it to... Um, I think okay. Don wanted it. It's 15, Don. Don. Okay, let's do that one. That's the next item, then. So that's going to be item okay. number... I forgot what number we were on. Oh, my God. Um, number Brian's 32. Forgotten. I don't know the number. Yeah, yeah we're on 32, Adrian. Okay. 32. You guys get ready it's a fry, to squish, it. mellow. Can you show it one more time really quick? The fries? Yeah. There you go. French fry, squish, mellow. That's going to be item number 32 for $15. Someone buy it before I do. <laughs> um, Madame Guma wants to know if you have the bearded dragon squish. No. Oh. Melissa, are you looking for a specific squish for Aria? Because V might have, have something. I have an incredible squish coming up next, and I have <gasps> multiples of one of my squish. No, Don, if you want it, take it, please. I have so many squishmallows. 
Okay. Don't worry. Oh, I'm gonna... looks like Linda called it first. All right, Linda. Oh, Linda's calling Linda the Squishmallow number 15. Congratulations, you Linda. Over the Thank you for taking it off of my hands because I have so many. Your turn, and then they can go back to fighting over squish. <laughs> okay, fine. Let's see a show. I'm just entertained time. watching you, so <laughs> Steph. I love it. Death. I'm dying. This is hilarious, you guys. All right. Um, up next. Oh, I still have this guy. Look how cute this is. Someone get this one. This is the little Alexander Wang. This That's is the so mini cute. Rocky. And it's in a leopard print fur. Love it. No, Linda, you don't have to buy it from me. <laughs> you don't have to do that. You're too nice. Don't, please. It's okay. What happened? What's taking place? I'm so confused. I hope people are emailing me because I'm very confused. <laughs> Um, also, if you paid me on Venmo, please email me an address. Yeah, okay, so you guys, if you paid V through Venmo, please send her your email, so, or your email, your address, so that way she can actually yeah. mail it to you. And yeah, if you, like, yeah, if you purchase anything, please just make sure to email V. Yeah, Katie paid me, but I have no address. Yeah. So. Okay. Oh, gosh. You guys are so nice to each other. I love you guys. Linda. Linda, you, you don't... Please don't. You don't have to buy me the French fries Squishmallow. It's okay. Oh, my gosh. I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. People love you, dude. They love you. Oh, when but... People, when people live shop with me, I get, like, randomly, like paid off in like items i'll be like oh my gosh i love this and then they'll be like run it and they'll be like keep it and i'm like what <laughs> <laughs> oh tara said she's gonna email you at the end of the live b okay thank you yeah um yeah. uh, but okay. this is our alexander wang super cute this is brand new it has the acid wash denim handles black pebbled leather body we have the leopard print fur on the sides, and then we have our beautiful little metal hardware in a silver on the bottom. Uh, this bag does also have the crossbody strap, I just have it tucked inside. And the interior has just one little uh, pocket in the back. It does have the original tag still attached right here. This retails for $595. And all of, like, the other tags and stuff are right here inside of the pocket. The only thing this doesn't come with is the dust bag. Uh, but this is going to be item number 33. And this is our Alexander Wang Mini Rocky with leopard print fur, black leather, and denim handles. And this is how much, Peter? Okay, this one was four twenty-five, but we're gonna do four hundred. Four hundred dollars for this guy, brand new, number thirty-three. All right, what do we got for your next squish, V? Number thirty-four. This is the, my favorite squish that I have. I sent her to Amazon, and then it got immediately pulled from inventory for one reason or another. So it was like never available. It went there, I know it was listed at like 35 or something, and then the uh -huh. listing got pulled, whatever. Uh -huh. This squish is like my spirit squish besides the lemon, but let me tell you about her. Okay, Lucia loves pepperoni pizza, duh, it's like my death row meal. Okay, the color yellow, and she's a middle child. Are you freaking kidding me? She paints, and she's ambidextrous. Oh. She's starting an art club. And she, did you guys ever watch Zaboomafu on PBS? No? Vadrian said they watched it. Yes, Vadrian. Are you <laughs> I ready? have no clue what that is. I've literally never it's heard of it. It's a freaking play. lemur. <gasps> oh my gosh, it's so cute. Look at her tail. Look at her tail. <laughs> it's two-tone pink. <laughs> so cute. It's a 
anyway, fifteen dollars. Fifteen? Wow. One five. One five. Fifteen dollars for number thirty-four. I'm Pink obsessed Lemur. Obsessed with her. Look how cute she is. Look at her little tail. Stop. Not me. Just putting Pink Lemur squish. I'm just putting Pink, Pink Lemur. Lemur. Okay. I want that for my daughter. Well, Melissa, get her. She's so cute. Yeah, Melissa, get it. Just make sure to type in the item number and the word mine, and then it's yours. Yay! All right, congratulations! Yay! We need the applause for this one. Yay! I'm the only human hand that have touched it. <laughs> All right! Yay! How exciting! Love that. I love her. Alright, 35 is up next, and I have, let's do, oh. I have this Rebecca Minkoff Mini Mac with rose gold hardware. Ooh. Yeah, black pebbled leather, the bag is in pretty good condition, just the hardware has a very minimal amount of wear, where the, oops, where the zipper pull is, just like right there in that area, just with high friction. Um, and the little studs are on the bottom. We have a pocket underneath this little lock right here. Interior has, uh, oh, it has like discoloration right at the top where the zipper is. Uh, but otherwise, the bag's in pretty good shape. This one's gonna be like a little bit of an as is bag though, since it's kind of like dirty on the inside. Uh, but it's number 35, black Rebecca Minkoff Mini Mac with rose gold hardware. And we're just gonna do this one for $20, guys. Okay, that's number 35 for 20 for our Rebecca Minkoff. All right. Adrian, do you know who bought the. Um, the snake Gucci, who wanted those? The snake Gucci, the shoes? Yeah, I haven't heard from them. No, no not, it wasn't gem drops, was it? No, it was Tara. Tara said she's going to email you at the end, so. Got it. I'm yeah, not so that's very Tara. smart with this. Yeah. I'm, not, I'm a newbie, guys. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, and Maria, Maria Thrash is calling number 35. Congratulations, Maria. <laughs> All right, Yay. you got the black Rebecca. Okay. Congrats. Perfect. Okay. Um, did I do an old standby? I feel like it's my what? very last one of this one. Are you ready? Yeah. Congrats, friend, on buying that bag. Good choice. Okay, it's a five-inch Olaf. <gasps> Olaf squish, so it's cute. My frozen, it's my very last Olaf. Do you want to build a snowman? You just do it for fifteen, my little guy. Look at his little hands. He's so cute. Oh my gosh, little hands are my favorite. Build a snowman. <laughs> All right, that's number thirty-six. Our five-inch Olaf squish for fifteen dollars. Olaf is so popular. He doesn't even get a bio. Bio. He's just Olaf. He's They're just like, Olaf. Everyone knows Olaf. who he is. Like it's Olaf. he's like. Madonna, Britney, Cher. Madonna, Britney, Cher. Yeah. Olaf. Olaf. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I love I'll... Maya. The ice cream is so freaking cute. Maya is so cute. I love her color combo. You know what's funny is that my um my friends from well they're from here but they lived in Romania for twenty years and they mm -hmm. worked with like abandoned kids and they raised their f four daughters in Romania. And they always said, like, oh, we would adopt. Like, we would adopt because Romanian residents and citizens are the only people that can adopt Romanian children. And um, one of their former youth got pregnant and was like, I can't raise this kid. Like, I need to get this kid up for adoption. And Cammie and Steve were like, we'll adopt her. Like, and it was the first time in 20 years that, like, the opportunity like came along where it was like somebody needed them. Mm -hmm. 
and they adopted her and she's so freaking cute and they just moved back to the states to take care of their parents um after like 20 years and i went to see them and this little girl ran up to me and gave me a hug she never met me before and she was like i'm maya <laughs> Oh, it's so cute. So she might be getting the ice cream. Aww. Oh, Carmen's <laughs> asking if that's a chicken that you have, like a chicken squishmallow. It, and I have multiple. It's a chicken clip. Yes, this is this is. Oh, cute. Carmen. It's, it's a, a clip. clip. Eleven dollars. I have a clip. Hadrian's just putting it in at this point. Um, I think I have two. I might have three of this. Okay, one. so that's number thirty-seven. Then is our chicken squish clip. 11 chicken bucks. clip, and I yeah. can check it more if anybody wants it. It's wearing overalls with a little daisy. It's cute. I know. <laughs> this chick has a resume. That's what it says. <laughs> she likes concerts like Taylor Swift. <laughs> She's Taylor Swift's biggest fan. <laughs> Stop. It's like, move over, V. There's a new Taylor Swift fan in town. And her name is Amy, and she's <laughs> two inches tall. <laughs> All righty. Our next bag and bag is... Oh, wait. Actually, let me do these shoes. Where's the other? Shoes? I lost Oh, the my God. Shoe. Shoes. Let's get some shoes. Okay, these are Ghani shoes. I just sold a Ghani dress. Yeah. Isn't Ghani for anthro? Um, yeah, I don't know. Maybe. How do you spell it? G A N N I. For anthro. For anthro. Oh, but Carmen, I, I think Carmen is calling it. Wait, what is she? I want it for a dog. She loves us. <gasps> Carmen, you are you calling it? Queen. Oh, she called it. Congratulations, Carmen. <laughs> Yay! I have at least one more chicken. Oh! Yeah, it went through Melissa. Mm -hmm. Let me check my squish inventory. You keep going. All right. Okay, so these are our Ghani shoes. These are all rubber. They're very comfy, according to my mom. And they are a size 40. And they are in really great shape. I've cleaned them up. And I love, like, how, like, I don't know, chunky the bottoms are. I just love a chunky shoe. And these are fantastic. And yeah, these are gonna be item number 38. There's the bottoms, not too much wear at all on them. And pink Ghani rubber shoes, size 40. This is embarrassing. Okay, we're doing these guys for $55. And that's item number 38. I love it. All right, what do you got, V? Oh, I, I do have two more chickens, if anybody wants a chicken. Okay, I have eight of this squish. I have eight of them. I'll do it for 30. It's huge. This is like, this is like 10. 10 question mark. Finding Solace at Home said 10 question mark. What oh, I 10? think they're asking for the um the U.S. size of these. Yeah. It is looking is it up like right now, but we'll let you guys ten. know. Hmm? Nine and a half time. Nine and a half mm -hmm. ten. Yeah, 40 would fit a 10. Okay, yeah, nine and a half, 10. Okay. This is embarrassing. Okay, I have eight of these. Eight. This what? is the Magic Mushroom Tie-Dye Squishmallow. It's a mushroom. It's a freaking mushroom. It's 14 inches, I think. Look at it, it's like from my chest to my head. Massive. It's got little dots like a mushroom. Her name is Curvina. Curvina, like Curvana. Um, it's a guy. He loves spending Saturday afternoon shopping for trendy thrifted threads. Whoa. Oh, we love that. Those. He has an eye for all things retro, lava lamps, cards, tie-dye, fringe jackets, you name it. Um, he always finds something cool and unique on his excursions. You want to go with him. That's what it says. I have eight of these. Wow. I, I was like, I'm embarrassed. Okay. I have eight of them. They have giggle, their own trail. <laughs> do I have any Lulu jackets? Hi, um, Chantal. I do. I need to know sizes. 
That will help me pull pieces. We miss oh, you too, Chantal. No. You guys gotta follow Chantal on Instagram. All of her like yeah. links are there. She's also a fellow reseller, and she's based in Canada. Oh, yeah. My oh, daily thrifting. That's her. her name on um, Instagram. I don't have Zelle. Is Carmen talking to me or you? Can I pay by Zelle? Oh, I think she's talking to you. Cause she bought the squish. I only have Venmo and PayPal. I've never used Zelle because there was like a bunch of scams on Zelle where like people would pay you for something on Marketplace and then they could cancel the transaction oh. within a couple hours. And Crazy. then people were just getting like their stuff taken. Uh -oh. Yeah. Oh wait, how much was the squish mellow again? I totally didn't type it out. Thirty. Thirty dollars. For for Vina. Yes, I have multiple. I have eight of them. Alright, she has so eight of these. So if anyone needs eight mushrooms. If you need eight mushrooms for all your grandkids. <laughs> Kathleen. <I'm done. laughs> oh, Lip is calling number thirty-nine. Yes, Congrats, yes. Linda! I don't know why I got so excited. Yay! Yay! Into the bag for Corvina. All right. Oh, and the shoes are a size ten. V, um, v, v Adrian looked up Magani shoes. They they're a size ten. So these are a size ten for yes, anyone Linda. that's interested. Love it. Up next, let's go to number 40. Boop, 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 boop. All right, I have this Dooney and Burr. This one is a beautiful little crossbody bag in this really nice suede. This one's brand new with tags. Uh, this one retails for $198. It's brand new. There's our inside. Um, this is my receipt. There's a zipper. Up top, a zipper compartment in the back, and then two open pockets in the inside. Okay. Has little feet on the bottom, and the color is called honey on this one. Honey. Honey. Oh, just like Mariah Carey. All right. It's just... Wait, wait. I sang honey one time in a car, and my friends thought I was Mariah, and that was like a oh. I was like, you are multi talented. What? I love it. You're so multi talented, multi faceted. Heartbreaker, you got the. She's dance. a dancer. She's a, she's like a gazillion threat. She has all the talents everywhere. It's because of the prosecco. I blame the prosecco that my vocal cords. Do you drink the whole bad. bottle tonight? I came across judgy. <laughs> no, I was just wondering. <laughs> well, first of all, a bottle of wine fits into this cup. So that'll yeah, happen. I did. I did. It was like two and a half glasses. It was nothing. I was depressed. They make the bottle look bigger than it like the bottle's thick. Oh, oh um, Finding Solace is asking if you have any Lulu jackets, size 12 to 14. Um, I'm going to grab Lulu after my next piece. So I'm going to go and look. If you guys have any other sizes you want, I know I have like sixes and fours in jackets. Um, and I have, I have one 12 top I'll grab that I know I have. Um, but yeah, if you guys, if you have like size like it requests, I will grab yeah. the best. Start request. typing out your sizes and like the items that you're looking for for Lulu. Okay. Yeah, that'll help me like pull pieces. Yeah. Oh, and this bag was 85. And that was item number 40. All right, V, you're up next, 41. <laughs> okay, Um, my last squish that I have for to offer is Whimsy the Watermelon. Um, also $15, a five inch little watermelon. Kind of looks like a strawberry, but it's a watermelon. I thought it was a strawberry, too. Everybody thinks it's a freaking berry. It's a watermelon. Okay. This was a Walgreens exclusive, so good luck finding her. Um, it's from Summer. Meet Winzy. His love language is cooking. It's like your mom. Yeah. Um, 
That's how he shows he cares. Come check out one of his famous backyard cookouts, jam-packed with funky music, dancing, delicious food, and great company. Everyone's invited to grab a plate. Oh. He's a lover. And it looks like Ashley's calling it. Congrats, Ashley. Ashley's got your watermelon. Yes, Woo! Yay! Oh, oh my gosh, I forgot I had the Prado. Still have the Prado's. Okay, I'm going to put what I still have up here. All right. I'm going to run and grab Lulu. You probably don't have 2X. No, but you guys, like, honestly, I'm not a gatekeeper with Lululemon. And plus size Lululemon is the easiest stuff in the world to find cheap. Um, and I can assist you if you send me a DM on Instagram. Oh, Carmen said, uh, I just used your email for Venmo, right? Oh, Carmen, her email for Venmo is down in Carmen, the description. Yeah. Hold on. Carmen, I'll, I'll put it my Venmo username. You have to click business when you're on Venmo. It's not a personal. It's just tell your friends OR, like Oregon. That's my Venmo username. Thank you, Hadrian. You're the best. Ah, you're okay. welcome. Okay, I'll be right back. You keep going. Ooh. <laughs> All right, guys. Up next, I have number 42 and let's do another little chanel this is that little chanel phone bag and it is in this beautiful glazed lambskin in a metallic well it's not really metallic it's more like an opalescent it's an opalescent blue with silver hardware this bag is in like new condition she's gorgeous nice long cross body strap you can double it up and wear it as a shoulder bag as well and then we just have, uh, this is like the little hardware on front. It has like that blue like inlay in there too, matches the leather. And then interior, I have, it comes with like the little care booklet and like the little um, authentication card from Chanel. And then here's the inside. The little serial or number is right there in the corner. It just has three compartments. Um, unfortunately... Like, the one downfall of this bag is that it doesn't fit the iPhone, like, Pro Max inside at all. Like, it does, like, the leather does not, like, really stretch at all. So, you'd have to have a smaller phone if you actually wanted to put it in here. But it's such a cute bag regardless. And it still fits a good amount inside of here. So, uh, this is going to be item number 42. Kathleen, yeah. She, you can definitely use PayPal instead. Just send her. Her email is right there. Just send her an email and then let her know what you purchased. And then um, she can send you an invoice. Or you can do a PayPal merchant. And then she, you just use her email right there. Uh, Carmen, my boyfriend will pay for it. He has Venmo, but he's asking her for a phone number. Oh, her info is... Hold on a second. I'm so needy. I'm sorry. <laughs> v, what was... Um, could you type out your your Venmo um, thing yeah. again, please? My Carmen's Venmo asking, is, yeah. Tell your friends, O-R... Like, Oregon, you just have to click business when you type it in, yeah. and then it'll show up. My PayPal is... It's all in the description box, too. So, it's of this video, it's in the description box. Yes, you're amazing. Okay. I know, Hypatia, we're far. Yeah, we're in. We're, we're in. in it. We're, we're moving and grooving. Is it my turn or your turn? Uh, hold on, let me, I'm just typing this out then. Uh, but what do you have next? So for, how much uh, is this one, Adrian? Wait, no, I did 41, you're 42. It's your turn. Your turn. Okay. Oh, no, I just showed it. I was just typing out the price. So, mm -hmm. this one's 1750 for this Chanel phone bag. It's, like, brand new condition. Veronica... Oh, Veronica, I did. I think I replied to you earlier, no? 
Kathleen. Oh no, it's okay. Yeah, Kathleen. Um, I think Kathleen would like you to send her a PayPal invoice. So I'll let you. I'll show you how to do it if you don't know how to. If, if yeah, later on. Yeah, we'll work it out. Yeah. Just if you yeah. just send me an email and say I need an invoice. Yeah. I also have Kathleen's info, so if yeah, I can okay. just I can just give it to you, then we can just send her the invoice. So just no things. This is just complicated. We're just on it. <laughs> Melissa, I know I'm I, I'm awful, Wait, but you the bag is so phone. pretty. Ooh, it's so pretty. Isn't it so pretty? It's iridescent. It's like it's just an opalescent, pearlescent. Hey, AJ was telling me that you guys have been all about that Chanel, and I was like, I'm envious. So. Here we are. Everybody gets a Chanel for Christmas. Okay. Okay, this is a Lululemon Love T2 in pink. It measures, it's like, a, it's like a light dusty pink. I can't remember the exact color. Me and Chantel actually fished for it for like 20 years, but here we are. It measures like a 12-14, so XL plus. Um, retail on these is like 58 or 68, but I'll do it for 30 shipped. Um, it's in great condition. This is Pima Cotton. If you saw my roller skating accident, you will know that Pima Cotton um, will survive anything, and my shoulder did not. So my shoulder was destroyed, and my cotton t-shirt was perfect. So I am a Lululemon ad at this point in my life. You really are, though. And the ohm is right here. On the back, it's a, it's matte, so so cute. They go with everything. I own um, Pima tees, the Love tee, and the All Yours tee. I own them in like a million colors. So no response yet. Maybe you were thinking about it. Ah, I say what? Pima Cotton is the best. Yes, it is. It's the very best. What's happening? Right, so that was uh, that was number forty. So that was thirty dollars. For that one. Yes. Okay. Trying to find. Next. Next up, we got number 44. Oh, they're small. Bummer. Okay. Oh, Veronica, I thought I did. I could have sworn I replied to you. Okay. I don't know, maybe my Apple is like going crazy, but wait, what do you say, Vedrin? But yeah, uh, Veronica, I'll re I'll re I'll resend what I said. Um, after the live, uh, 44, let's do, but isn't she beautiful? That's gorgeous. That's so pretty. Colors are like, uh, but I'm going to tempt you guys with another one. Here is a, another Chanel bag. I'm just <laughs> pulling them all out. This one is a red <laughs> flap. And this is the accordion style flap. I actually really like this one because it holds more than the regular like shaped flap bags. And this one has a nice large back pocket, which will hold fit on, your Hold bag. on, hold on. Is that another Chanel? Yeah. Where have you been shopping? Everywhere. You just like pull out like six Chanel bags in the last 48 hours? <laughs> so... <laughs> no, it I has a Chanel bag in my life consignment. And this man, this guy is beautiful. Look at all that space inside. This one is in really, really, really good condition too. There's a back zipper pocket, and then just these two other compartments. Uh, you can wear this one as a shoulder bag or as a crossbody. So, shoulder bag, it's doubled up like this. I'm unwell. And then crossbody. You can tuck, you can keep it up like this or tuck it into the interior of the bag. Um, I want this one. <laughs> oh, it's such a beautiful bag, though. Um, I know. You are the Chanel king. Listen, I want you to sell all these Chanel's and then I want you to have, like, the cash flow to invest in that orange or mess that I can then buy off you for, like, a $500 markup. Okay. You can just, like, find the bag. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny because it's, like, not even me at all. Like, the only reason that I would buy the Birkin is to, like, look at it, carry it a few times, and then, like, it's an invest. It would be part of my portfolio because... Listen, when you work in a church, you can't be like that. People are like, why don't you keep the Gucci's? I'm like, can you imagine me rolling into church? I could. 
I definitely Gucci would. sneakers and then like trying to justify to people I got them at a consignment store like no this is not it's not it's not the look it's not the look for me <laughs> not the one fine even though I feel like it's totally fine but whatever <laughs> Okay, so our, the red Chanel was $28.50, $2,850 for our red Chanel. She's a beauty. And um, Melissa, that blue Chanel is calling your name. She's gorgeous. I'm buying all my gift cards to buy the Pikachu long shop. Oh my gosh, finding solace. Um, oh, Tara said she sent you two emails because she forgot to write, she forgot to... I got um, it. Yeah, okay, perfect. <laughs> But you guys, if you, um, okay, so plus size Lulu secondhand, the only time I find it is when I do my live thrift, and when I find it, I sell it immediately, so, and you can get it at a deal if you're there, so if you just come to my live thrifts every week, like, that's your best possibility of getting it, like, let's put it that way, so, it, getting it secondhand, like, yeah. Or if you want something, like, I can help you find it. But I don't, like, I never have it. Which is heartbreaking. <laughs> like, I never have it. It's so hard. Yeah. Are you cutting out? Can you hear me? Yeah. So no, you're fine. No, I was reading the comments. Sorry. Got it. Um, this week, I'm going to do a Black Friday Live thrift at 2 o'clock Pacific. So, and I'm going to go in the morning um, and pick pieces up. So if I find bigger, if I find like larger pieces in the morning, I'll put them on Instagram before I list them. Um, I usually do that, but then I'm going to do a live at two and they're going to be putting out pieces like all day. So. Um, Crime Solver was asking what app that you, oh, she goes live on what, on, on whatnot, right? Yeah, I go live on whatnot, but I link that I'm going live on Instagram, just okay. like Hadrian does. So it'll be like, I'm live, and there'll be a countdown, so that, like, if you see it later, you'll be like, did I miss it? Nah. You know, the countdown's just so people don't know they missed it. Yeah. Yeah, All right, Lulu makes plus. What do you have next? Oh, it's my turn? Yeah. Yeah, Lulu plus. makes plus, um, but they only make certain styles in plus. What do I have next? Um... Okay, let's do this Grail cup. Okay, you guys, this is like one that I've been holding. Um, I have it at a hundred on Amazon. I think the going rate is like seventy, so I'll do it for like sixty shipped. Hadrian and I both have it. And Vadrian. <laughs> yeah. And Vadrian, yeah, we all have it. We all got it together. Yeah, you and did. I you. Sold a bunch yeah, of you did. This is the last one I have. I've sold a bunch of them. But this is the last one. It's the, what do they call it? It was like the lavender. I don't remember what the color, like the actual color name was. But it's like lavender iridescent. Yeah, but it's, it's so pretty. The rock star. Oh, yeah. God, it feels so good. You can match us with this grail of a cup that you'll never it's see beautiful. again. It's beautiful. It's beautiful. It's my favorite awesome. one. Oh, it's so good. Okay, that one was sixty dollars. Number forty. Linda, <laughs> Linda's like, oh my gosh. Okay. That question was for you, V. That question was for you. What part of Canada? You got that right, Melissa. I'm so far behind, y'all. Ba 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 ba. What did I miss? I don't know. I'm trying to look now too. <laughs> I missed it also. What did Veronica say? Adrian is the Chanel King. What part of Canada? I shipped to Canada on whatnot. Chantel's in Canada. Yeah, they go 18 to 20. LuLaRoe, LOL. <laughs> uh, oh, I think they were asking yeah. where Chantal was in Canada. She's Maybe. in Edmonton area. And Chantal just came back right now too. She says, I'm I'm here, I was on the bike. Oh. Oh, I have shoes. I forgot I have shoes. I'll do that next. Oh, okay. Oh, that's right. It's my turn. Uh, okay, number 46. Turn. What do I have? Let's see. Mm -hmm. Did I already show all the Chanel that I had? Mm -hmm. 
If you didn't, I'd be surprised. But <laughs> no, let's really. do the little Hermes thing that I have. So this is a little Hermes, oh, just a little Hermes like Hermes coin thing. pouch in a really pretty pink. I think this is an Epsom leather. It has silver hardware. The little button right there is in really good shape. There's no like scratches or anything on it. And the leather is in pretty good shape too. The only flaw I think is this little like dot that's not coming up on camera. Where is it? I can't even see it anymore. There it is. It is right there. And it's not coming up on camera, but it's a tiny little like lighter piece of pink, I guess. Here's the interior when you open it up. There's the Hermes damping right there. It's in perfect shape. And then this is like the oh. origami like coin pouch. So origami. it like opens up. Yeah, you it's guys, really cool. You know what? You know what it's good for? Your emergency pay phone money. That's where you're gonna put your two quarters. Right it is. There. Yeah. And the little serial number is embossed right there on the side. So this is number 46, our MS pink coin pouch. Okay, we're gonna do this one for just one fifty. Doing a $1. deal on this one, one hundred and fifty dollars. One dollar and fifty. Fifty cents. <laughs> wrong size Hermes, sir. Wrong color, wrong size. <laughs> <laughs> wrong style. All right, what do you got next, Woo! V? What shoes do you have? Oh my gosh, you're fine. You're fine. Oh my gosh. I, I was confused. Yeah, I'm not in Canada. I'm in Oregon, just above Hadrian. Okay, I have some Saludos um, espadrilles. These are so freaking cute. They're giving Palm Springs. Um, they're a size women's eight. And they have cacti. Look at the cacti. Oh, they're so cute. I love cacti. Yes. Yeah, they're Saludos. Very clean. Just a little warehouse marking on the bottom, but these little cacti. And uh, we'll just do them for like 40 shipped. All right. These are 40. Interior, super nice. I love them. I love the little embroidered cacti. You have two varieties of cacti. That one is like the spiky one, and this one's closer to like the, um, what do they call this one? The uh, prickly pear. Don't ask me why I know that. It's, I taught fourth grade social studies. Okay. Oh, Melissa's flying to uh, Oregon on Monday to Bend to see her parents. <gasps> oh my God, I love Bend. I Is that near you? Bend. I have no clue. It's like two and a half hours that way, but yeah, it's near. Oh, okay. It's a little far. I mean, Oregon's, Oregon's massive. I go to Bend to thrift. Melissa, if you want to know where to thrift in Bend, send me a DM because let me tell you, I know the places. <laughs> what did Taylor say? What did she say? But she said, I know places. Oh, I, I know places. I know places. Tristan Greenwell says, love it. Hi, Tristan. How's it going? Thanks for joining I us tonight. Places. We're having too much fun. Oh, there's even more of you guys in here than there were earlier. So let me leave the link again. Really quickly for tonight's giveaway. We're giving away Let's the Keith sunglasses. So there's the link right there. Here are the sunglasses. They're super cute. They're black metal. And their frame, like the, the lenses, are like a gradient orange to yellow. And they're very festive for fall. So this is our giveaway. And oh, V still has those beautiful Prada sunglasses right there. In really great shape. They come with a box. They also have yes. that little cleaning thing inside. And really, really nice. Super cute. Yeah. They're in a tortoise shell. They're so extra that they, like, emboss the cleaning cloth. It says Prada. I mean, you got to. Got and to those guys are $150. That's item number two, if anyone's interested. Those are the Prada sunglasses. Number Spring three for 150 2007. Almost vintage. Almost. Almost. Oh my gosh, imagine. All right, up next, we got, um, oh, okay, I'm next. 48. She's have to find something. Okay. I'm taking requests. <laughs> oh, V's taking requests for anything. If anyone's looking for anything specific, V might have it for you. I am, I am now taking requests. Otherwise, I'm going to go fish for cute things. All right, I got... 
in this box, a little Valentino box. I have some Valentino rock stud flats. And these are in a beautiful Ooh. light pink leather with the gold studs. So pretty. Um, they do have a little wear on the left shoe, right in like the front. There's like a little bit of rubbing right there. And also just a little like mark right there on the side of the right shoe. Uh, these are in a size 37. Not too much wear on the bottom and the insoles are in really great shape. Uh, I still also just come with the extra studs. And it has a dust bag and all of like the original stuff that came in the box. And these are number 48. Where oh my mouse stopped working. My mouse just died. Hold on. I have to like plug this one in. All my stuff is dying at the same time. All right, let me just use my computer. Okay. Uh these are our pink Valentino stud rock stud flats. Really cool powder. Size 37. And how much are they, Adrian? These are, okay, we had them for like 255. We're going to do them for just 200 tonight. And they're in pretty good shape other than what I showed you. And they come with the box, the dust bag, extra studs, and that is number 48. <laughs> Tara. My mom really loves these shoes. She's really sad that these don't fit her because she's a size like eight and a half. But they're such cute shoes. Okay. Uh, up next. Okay, V's still gone, so I'm just going to continue then. All right, let's do 49. And I have for you guys... Oh, this Michael Kors phone bag. Super cute. It has a Michael Kors hardware right here, and it has a little turn lock. You can open and close it. Uh, it has a crossbody strap, which is removable. The chain is actually really nice. It has card slots on the back. This is a black soft on leather as well. When you open it up, here's like the phone compartment. Um, there's a little bit of wear underneath here, because that's the part that like kind of hits the hardware when you close it. So... It's pretty much unavoidable, but it's in a nondescript location. Ah! Oh my gosh, I smacked my phone against my table. And phone fits inside really nicely, even with the case and the pop socket. And, hold on, actually. Let me just make sure it does actually do that. Oh yeah, <laughs> really nicely. No, I have like all this paraf paraphernalia on my phone. Yeah, so this is, it's soft vinyl leather as well in black. And this is uh, number 40. 49 black MK a leather phone bag with silver hardware. This is how much, Peter? Okay, we got this one for $55. Is Adrian uh, sick of it? Oh, let me put the giveaway link for Veronica really quickly. Here you Hi, go, Veronica. Melissa. <laughs> Melissa's sleeping on the Chanel. All right, Hello. Melissa, have a good night. Thanks for joining us. Bye. <laughs> All right, V, what do you got for number 50? I'm like, I believe we're number 50. Look at us go. Okay, I have... Okay, like, I'll do a bag. Okay, this is so freaking cute. Um, it has a little bit of, like, surface staining on it, and I don't know how to get it off, but it's Kath Kidson. It's, like, um, like a textured vinyl, so you can, like, clean it. Mm -hmm. uh, I haven't tried, so I'm like Hadrian. I just have a bag, a pile of bags. I haven't tried, um, but it's pretty clean on the inside. It's canvas interior, but it matches. It's got a little pocket. Oh, apparently it was like new because there's the little plastic coating on the zipper. Um, yeah, and it has little pockets inside. It has adjustable backpack straps. It's like a little mini backpack. So cute. It's so cute. Yeah, and it has a top handle. Two, there's a little nick on the top handle. Nothing crazy, but yeah, I would just do it for like 20. All right, $20. Something a little mini backpack. 
It's so cute. It's very like Y2K. It is. It is clueless, but also like cutesy because of the polka dots. And I like you guys I like have never seen cat kids and bags are really cute, really popular. A lot of times they have like floral or like polka dot. So cute. So cute. So cute. I almost forgot about Vadrian. Oh. I know I Chantal. Vadrian is kind of offended. Not really. Vader didn't even notice that you said that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Do you remember when I threw pizza at the dog? Yeah. <laughs> oh, everyone was like, oh my god, why are you throwing stuff at the dog? I was house sitting for for Yuki. Oh my gosh. And I was like eating the pizza. I was starving and I gave her the crust. I was like, finger Yuki. Did <laughs> you just throw pizza? I was like, yeah. You're like, uh. Alright. I, I can't believe you remember that, Chantal. I was like, oh my gosh, I just came back. But, like, all the as soon as she said it, I remembered. Like, I have a photographic memory. I don't forget anything. <laughs> Alright. Oh, is it late for you already, V? Uh, no, it's like 10.30. I don't work. Well, I, I'm just making sure. I don't want no, you to be tired or anything. You guys, I didn't want to start at 10. I was like, if we start at 10, it's going to be me. And like the yawning show from like eleven onward, so <laughs> no way. Enough. Okay, so I got a rag and bone. This is a wallet on a chain. This is in Ooh. a mustard suede, and then the back is just in a regular smooth leather. There is a slight discoloration right at the top, right here on the suede. I try to remove it. This is as light as I could get it. So just know that that's there. The rest of the suede, though. Is in really good shape. It has light gold hardware. The strap, too, is removable. And then the interior, you have a front little zipper pocket right there. And you just got six built-in card slots. And that's pretty much it. It just has a snap closure up at the top. And that is number 51. Our mustard Call it by its name. It's a walk. You taught me Call that. It it's a, a walk. <laughs> and... And how much is this one, Vedrian? Let's do... It's a 139 Oh, yeah. We're going all freaking night. All right, this one's $75. That's going to be item number 51. 51? Okay. Yeah. This might be my last one. Unless people are into it, I have more of this type of item. All right, what is it? Oh, and I also didn't, like, do this one. Just in case. Okay. Just run it. I don't need any more cups. A vintage silk scarf. And it's Ooh. like a big rectangle. It's not branded. It could, it could be designer. It could not. I don't know. I got an estate sale. So, you know, it's the, the other items at the estate sale were nice. Okay. It's like this geometric red, yellow, black. Almost uh -huh. like Germany. You could do so much with it. You could tie it on your bag. You could, you could do this. You could YouTube how to tie scarves. Um, it's Fifteen dollars, and I have multiple vintage silk scarves, like beautiful little things. If you're into it, you said fifteen dollars, right? Yes. Yeah. Super light to ship. It doesn't have. It doesn't seem to have anything like negative going on with it. Uh, a tiny spot here. You could hand wash them very gently, you know. Is it like hand sewn, like the little like sides, like the, you know, like how they're hand rolled or whatever? It's rolled. It's yeah. rolled. Yeah. And then like stitched. Yeah. Yeah. It's so pretty. It's just soft. It's pretty. It's fun. Yeah, the I color combo is like, really nice. Good for fall. I have a lot of like these scarves and the more I look at them, I'm like, these would be so cute to like decorate your house with if I could just figure out how to like lay them out. You know what I mean? Yeah. Or you like, can frame them. them. Shelf, It'd be really like great my... to frame them. Yeah. Oh, Maria wants to know what other colors you have. Let me grab them. I think I have like four or five right now. They're all different styles. Oh. <laughs> all right. Well, she grabs them. Um, I'll do our next item, which is going to be 
this uh I have this sky blue Comme des Garcons wallet and it has gold hardware. It's super cute. It's in really good shape. The exterior is really nice. It's just a smooth leather. And then when you open it up, it opens blue? up all the way. Yeah, it's a really pretty sky blue. It's my favorite color. Yeah, it's a Comme des Garcons wallet. So and it's made in Spain. Snapping's right there. We got the card slots. And then we got our little change pocket right here. It's lined in black leather. And yeah, it's in excellent shape. So this is number 53, our sky blue leather comme de garçon zip around wallet with gold hardware. I'm just realizing how much more of the background you guys can see that I'm, than I see on here. Oh, really? Like, how are they seeing these squish behind me? But now I'm realizing, like, you can see my whole shelf. Yeah. <laughs> Your setup is so cute, though. I love it. Did you see my little countdown? Yeah. Look at these. They're so cute. They're little houses. I love it. It's, well, there's more than houses. There's, like, there's trees and snowmen. Little village. So All cute. Things. That's one of my favorite brands, too. Isn't that the, like the heart shoes? Yeah. Yeah. They need little hearts. Okay, that this wallet was seventy dollars, guys. Okay, okay. Can show all them the show them those other scarves. I'll show you all the scarves and then if somebody wants one you can plug it in if you need to. Okay. So this one is vintage Bill Blass. Oh, that's so pretty. It's huge and it's gorgeous. I'll do them all for fifteen. I don't it's fine. Like whichever one you want. This one's like a big square. I think it's 30 by 30 or it's close to that. Um, then I have this one's Calvin Klein. It does have a little like, I think it's sap on it, but it's not super visible. So it says Calvin Klein on it. And then it has the Calvin Klein silk tag. Um, there's a couple spots on it, but then it has this like, I think it, it's like cranberry or juniper, like uh -huh. on it. And dot plaid on the edges. It's a square. There's a couple spots right here on uh, the edge. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But like, I mean, depending on how you fold it, like irrelevant. Mm -hmm. Um, and then these two are smaller, like almost like pocket square size. This one has the tag, which is how I know they're silk. They're 100% silk, made in India. These ones I think would be so cute, framed. Yeah, that'd be so pretty. Oh, Maria's calling number 52. That uh, the first scarf that you showed. Oh, Yay! Yeah. Okay. Congrats, Hooray. Maria! Um, yeah, this one is like the pink and yellow. That's and great. Then I like that one. I also have this one. It's a blue. Oh, I love the color on that one. I, like I know. That. And this one has little flowers. These are all from like one estate sale. So that's how I know they're all silk. <laughs> They're very fancy people. Let's put it that way. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I want to go to some more. I've never been to an estate sale, but they always. I so love cool. them. Yeah, and silk is. I mean, silk is delicate, so there could be some like minor imperfections, but like they're so pretty. I just couldn't leave them. Yeah, you could even just like tie them on your handbag, or, like a little decorative accent, you know. Fifty-two blue. Oh, she also likes the blue one. Wait, wait, wait. And the pink one, I think. Wait. Which ones do you want, Bestie Maria? <laughs> I know Maria. I think she wants all of them. Just do fifteen each, and then let me know which ones you want. Bing bing. Yeah, Twilly for a purse. I know. I think they'd be so pretty on a purse. Bing. This is when I'm like, the chat isn't fast enough. I know. <laughs> It's almost like when I say goodnight to you, I'm like, goodnight, and then I have to wait, like, 45 seconds. Yeah. Like, and I'll be like, okay, bye. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bye. <laughs> he saw. He acknowledged. Time. All three, not the brown. So these three? I think those are the three, because she likes the pink one, the blue one, and that first one. Just not the brown one with the flowers. Not the brown. Okay. She did not call the Bill Blast. Do you want the Bill Blast, Veronica? Congrats, Maria. Yay! Okay. 
<laughs> yeah, Maria, just send me 45. Um, and the Bill Blast, I do not believe she called this one. So Yeah, that's the purple one. If Veronica wants the purple, she can have it. This is the one that I was like, this would be such a cool like tablecloth. Yeah, it actually would be really pretty. But it's huge. Or well, you know like sometimes people like, like, like drape like the scarves over like the lamp. That'd be really pretty over a lamp too. BB. BB? BB. 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 The pink reminds me of Hermes too. Yeah. Bing bing. Bing bing. Yes. Okay. Perfect. Yeah, just Yay. Congrats. email, whatever. Thank you guys. Those are so pretty. I love them. Yeah, I like the Calvin too. I wish it didn't have a spot. Makes me sad. It could be cute tied up in a bag. Maybe. <laughs> As I tie it on a bag and see if it looks cute. Okay. Let's find out together. Spend oh, Maria time. also wants the Bill Blast scarf, too. Oh, shoot. That's why she okay. said BB for Bill Blast. That makes sense. I'm sorry, Veronica. Okay. Wait, does that mean... Okay, Maria, just send me an email for the ones. That was the BB. I'm so confused. Oh, she wanted the Bill Blast, the pink one, and the blue one, and the okay. first one. So she wanted four. That's you why she said four? BB. That's why we were kind of confused. Please confirm yeah. that you want all four. Oh my gosh, seriously? Stop. That's actually, actually really cute. cute. It's actually cute. Yeah, that's what I thought. Anyways, uh, oh, okay, not the first one. She wants Bill Blass. She doesn't want the first one. Okay, so she wants the Bill Blass, the pink, and the blue. Check. Got it. Okay. If not I tie them way. together, then we'll be set. <laughs> I won't separate them. Okay, got it. I got it. I got it. I got it, Queen. Thank you. You're perfect. Everyone is perfect. <laughs> ah, she has a oh, Tanya, the over Tanya. 500 scarves. <gasps> I love scarves. Like I love them, and I have a I have a client that um, shops with me and thrifts with me almost every week. And so now I'm at the point where oh my gosh, I got her one yesterday. I'm at the point where anytime I'm at an estate sale, bins, garage sale, wherever, like anywhere where I'm getting them for like a quarter um, or to like $3 or something, I will pick them up. Um, and then when I pack her order, I put one in every week because she wears them in her hair. Oh, okay. Yeah. So if you follow Sky Thrifts, like almost every headscarf she's wearing is from me. <laughs> That's cool. Sky it's so Thrifts. Fun. It's my little tradition. I'm like, thank you for modding. Oh, I love oh. that. Oh, speaking of scarves, I have a scarf. Hold on. Show it. I want Hold on. I just remembered I have a little bit of a death pile in the garage, and I want to see what's in it. Wait, hold on. I lost the scarf. What do I found the scarf? I forgot what I got yesterday. All right, I have a scarf. Okay, this is a Fendi scarf. This one is new with tags. It's from Netta Porte. And it is uh, the Fendi Carl scarf. And it has like the monogram cursive S logos. And it's so pretty. It's in this beautiful camel color. It's a cashmere blend. And it has like the little fringy bits at the end. And the other side is just like in a, it's just like a one tone. So it doesn't have a print on it. So you kind of have two scarves in one. It's super fun. It's actually like really cute on. Like look how cute that is. Right? So, okay. Uh, this is item numero 54. Okay. So this is our Fendi Carl scarf in tan. New with tags. And this one is 450. 50, but let's okay. Our special Black Friday price is gonna be three ninety five. <gasps> I know what a deal. All right, fifty four. And this is um 
I believe this is $800 still on the website. And I don't think anyone is even selling it secondhand anywhere online. I think I'm like the only person that has this for resale right now. Um, it's a wool... Hold on one second. Where is it? Um, it's a... Cashmere wool blend. Yes, 51% wool, 49% cashmere. And it's not the wool that I'm allergic to. Otherwise, I'd be really itchy right now while it's on my face. So, it's... <laughs> I'm, like, allergic to, like, some wools. Not this one, though. Okay. So, it's not... It doesn't make me itchy. So, that's 54. All right, what do you got, V? Okay, I found, I found another item. Good night, store. Kathleen. I found something I forgot I had. Okay, these are size eight and a half. And they are the Sorel Joan of Arctic Wedge, the Chelsea Wedge. And they are very gently used, like very gently used. This is the toe. And you can tell by the bottom. Yeah, those look in really good shape still. Yeah. Beautiful. Come with the box. They're like this soft um, leather. Soft leather, size eight and a half, and I just do them for a hundred shipped. I think their retail is like 185 or higher. I don't remember. But yeah, with the box, size eight and a half. All right. Ooh, Chantal, them. they're your oh, size. The, um, the logo on the back of this one is like just barely like pulling, like one stitch is missing. And I think it's because when the person took them off, they like put the toe to it, you know? Uh-huh. Like when you push it off, that's what it looks like. But it's still very much on there. Not ah! me trying to wear this scarf right now. But... Why can't anyone have a nine? Maria, 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 Maria. You remind me of a West Side Story. Ooh, growing up in Spanish Harlem. A living life just like a movie star. Oh, Maria, Maria. So we're just like singing now. Okay. <laughs> oh I love God, karaoke. That's, That's what's going to happen on Thanksgiving. I got three what pairs of What are you doing? Is that a mink? What is happening? What is that? What? What? What is that scarf? Wait, who? Me? Yeah. This? That was cute. This is the Fendi scarf, girl. Stop. That is so good. I know. It's the Fendi Carl scarf. It's still on the Fendi website. And I haven't found one anywhere else for resale. And the retail of this is like $800. Oh my gosh. Brand new attacks from Netaboard. I have a pair of um I have a pair of Doc Martin boots that I just listed that are not they're like kinda worn though. They're they're pretty rare, but they're kinda worn. I put them on Depop. Oh. They're a nine. Um they're like floral docks, like platform boots. Um, oh platform floral docks. Not full platform, but you know the docks. Do I? Um, and then I'm trying to think what else I have. And a nine, I don't know. I don't know. But if you go to, if like, okay, if you guys are like, want to poke around, my Poshmark is just tell your friends. And if you send me an offer for like 30 to 40% off anything, I'll accept it. So just. Oh, go crazy. Go to her Instagram. Like All her links are on there. 500 items on there right now. I yeah. think I'm fine. Like over 500. So shop away. There's shoes. There's. So much. There's so much. So. Jocelyn, the wool doesn't feel itchy at all. It's a cashmere wool blend. And Ooh, I'm generally like allergic to wool and it makes me really itchy. And if it's on my skin mm -hmm. long enough, I break out in hives. And this is like totally perfect on me. So doesn't feel That's itchy cool. at all. It's such a nice scarf. And Don, I love those Doc Martens that you bought. I'm so excited that you bought them. I actually have what a pair of Doc Martens right here. These are a size eight and a half. And they're a black, uh, like a, what's the word? It's not like a shiny patent. It's kind of like a, what do we call this, like, finish? <sighs> Mia, yeah. 
You can get me at like Kroger too. Huh? What do you call that black finish? Let me see. It's like not a patent, but it's like a. Is it matte? Right? It's like a matte. Oh, matte patent. It's like a matte patent, right? Like oil slick. Yeah, it's not like mm -hmm. super shiny, but. Mm -hmm. Or it might just be like the regular. I don't think this is the regular one. Is it? It could be that they've been polished too. Maybe. But they're just black socks. These are size eight and a half. Um, Ooh, cute. They're in like they're in pretty decent condition. What's the number? On them, are they a one nine? Wait, nineteen forty eight, eighteen. How do you check the tag? It's on the tag. It'll say like somewhere on the tag. It'll say like men size, women size, and then like, oh, there's four digits. Wait, what did you say, Adrian? Everyone was talking at the same time in my ear. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, they're the black stitching ones. Man, I cannot, I can never see the numbers on these unless I'm like, oh, they're mono black. Mono black, yeah. Monochrome black. Do docks run big, small, or true to size? Uh, you want to size a half size down. And half then size down. Okay. So you want to go a half size down from what you normally wear, Linda? Or true to size. Or they're true to size. I yeah, guess. either either is works. It just depends on like they're gonna stretch out. Like the dock, the leather itself is gonna stretch. So if you want it to fit true to size in like a year, you want to go a half size it down. Yeah. I get size seven. I usually wear size seven. Yeah, oh, I get nine. I wear a nine and a half, but I can also get a nine and a half. But like. Usually if I buy them at a consignment store and they're a nine and they've been like worn a little bit, they're already stretched out to a nine and a half. So they're like perfect. Okay. If your foot's wider though, I would say go true to size. Okay. So how much are these, Adrian? 65. These are 65. I resell those for like 120. Let's go. Linda. Linda, I think they will fit you, but I am, I'm not a hundred percent certain. I'm not like a doc expert. I don't like <laughs> gray docs too often. Are they, is any of the sizing rubbed off? Yeah. Then that means they're a little bit broken in because that yeah. rubs off really quickly. Yeah. But these are, um, my mom said that they're like pretty big on her with she's a size eight and a half. So if you wear a size nine, they'd probably fit you. Cause yeah, she's probably just yeah. been stretched. So they've probably been stretched out already. Yeah. That's good. Cause trust when you get them, it's brutal. Yeah. Like, you, when you buy them brand new, I suggest people sleep in them, which is stupid. But, sleep like, in them. no, put on two pairs of socks, tie them, like, loose, and literally wear them around your house doing anything and everything for, like, two days. Sleep in them because your feet, like, swell when you're sleeping. And then, like... I can't even sleep in socks. I would I, die. I get it. Just have to just you just have to suck it up, okay? And that's why I'm not gonna take, wear any ducks. Take a nap on the couch with your feet elevated. Just trust. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on a second. You can show your next item. I gotta go get something for my mom. Right. Oh, I only have one. I only have one item left, but I'll show you guys what still remains. So we still have this coach bag. We still have this coach bag. I don't remember the numbers. We still have a, a Lululemon black belt bag that is apparently sold out now. The standard for 75, new with tags. And several squish, Olaf, Blake the bunny, um, Maya the ice cream, Prada Sunnies, all the Starbucks cups. The last one is this one, it would be 45. Um, it's, this is the iridescent, uh, orange with the swiggle straw. Iridescent orange is from Halloween. So, if you love orange, like Mr. Hadrian, I'm telling the truth. Thank you. Wait, what happened? I'm just showing them my last cup. <sighs> it's so yeah. cute. It could be yours, but. Adrian's like, I don't need a cup. Made in England. No. Good night, Tanya. Oh,
All the docks are not made in England, so made in England docks are the vintage ones. Most were made before like 2006, which is, you can see on the bottom, they'll say made in England. Um, and like the ones that you sent me, they resell way higher, way more expensive. They're more expensive to begin with. Like, and then commercially in the last like 15 years, Docs has sent their production to China. So the quality is still there, but it brought the price point down to like the everyday consumer. So boots that used to be 300 are now like 150. But mm -hmm. how much are the not, how much is the orange cup? And we had 45. That? $45, $45, Maria. And that oh, one's yeah. gonna be what number are we on? It's orange. 57. So that's number 57. That's um orange, brand new, brand new, all brand new. Okay, so that so yeah, we have orange. That guy, right all of these there. are forty-five. Orange, pink, the jelly stud, and the bejeweled. <laughs> pink is like my color, apparently. I have a glow in the dark one that Mackenzie has, but I haven't gotten it from her yet. A glow in the dark one? Oh, Maria's calling number 57. She's calling your cup. Yes, queen. Yay, congrats. congrats. <laughs> Woo! That woke me up. All right. Mm. How much for the cup? <laughs> I love this one, but. Yeah. But we're biased too. Purple curly? Like I'm secretly a purple girly, but like not it. really. Cause you know, purple girlies are purple girlies. You know, the purple girls—they're all purple. <laughs> they go hard for purple, and the ladies know. Listen, my phone is the lavender purple iPhone. I can't tell you the number of times a week people stop me and they're like, you have the purple iPhone. Do you like, do you love purple? And I'm like, no. <laughs> I just have a purple one. My mom cute. also has the purple one. <laughs> Your mom has the purple? Yeah. Is she a purple girly? No, <laughs> but she's just like, I want a purple phone. So then she got one. That's how I felt. I was like... All these colors are so masculine, or I can get yeah. over it. She's just like, I want a different color. She's like, I'm tired of having like all these other colors that I always get. So, ooh, auburn, yeah, that'll be cute. Mmm, mm, that's perfect. Yeah. Um, I actually just sold my last keychain. I sold my last ornament and my last uh, keychain. Oh, no but more Jocelyn, Starbucks keychain. Jocelyn, Jocelyn, send me a message on Insta. My store had. Keychains. They had the studded keychains and the state keychains. Stop. They had the studded keychains. Like, what color? They had the gold and the pink, and they also have the all gold studded tumbler still. And they, I don't know if they have the cranberry one still. I didn't buy any of them. But okay. Sure, I don't. Do I need any of those? But <laughs> I mean, the gold one. This I, I, I kind of might. Need only, what? Is it's going to go up in value. Like I just haven't bought it. Like I've just been. Lazy. Okay, if they, if you okay. find, if 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 you go over there and they happen to have a gold one, can you pick one up for me, please? Yeah, I'll call you tomorrow. Yeah, I'll hit you up tomorrow when I go over there and get a coffee. Because I like, might also need one of the keychains too, or maybe like all. <laughs> the keychains, yeah. the retail on the keychains is like fifteen now. Okay. On the studded ones, yeah, they're man, they're in it. They know that people love them. And they're yeah, like, they do. I yeah. Wait, Vader, you need? Do you want a gold them. one too? The pink and the blue ombre. Okay. Uh, okay, Vader, Vader says that Vader <laughs> might need a pink one or a, <laughs> or a gold one. <laughs> okay, just I'm gonna message you tomorrow morning. Yeah, just let me know. Let I'm me know what you find. Yeah. Yeah. I'll be like, do you want this? Tell yeah. me now. Perfect. Because okay. I know that they sold out the morning that they released. And then I talked to Jordan because I, I went to get one that morning. She was like, they sold out by 9 a.m. She's like, but I'm getting a restock. And it's a big restock. 
and she got her big restock and it's been there for like five days and they're not wait time out stores get restocks our stores never get restocks they're like we only have that first batch that's it ever no they get restocks based on their volume so if you're at a high volume store they always get a restock Mm -hmm. but like a low volume store won't and my starbucks is the number one performing store in the valley so they get restocked every time interesting yeah and then the safeways and like the safeways get the largest stock um like mackenzie found my glow in the dark at a safeway not start at not target oh i really want to glow in the dark one too yeah i only have one it's coming um and they made a glow in the dark keychain god some people man they're in it <gasps> the blue you're looking for the pink and the blue ombre do you want the um keychain or you want a cup? Because I feel like I saw the blue. The <laughs> if anyone's cup. looking for a specific cup, yeah, email email j- email her. Your email address is I'll right be there. A dealer. She's your Starbucks <laughs> queen. I'm in a Starbucks like four or five times a week, and I always look and scan. I scan them on Amazon just to see where they're sitting. To see their, not necessarily to see the price, but to see the rank. Because mm-hmm. I want to know if it's like got a good rank. Because um, that means that it's, it's selling and it will eventually, the price will eventually go up. So, mm-hmm. I got the green glow in the dark. They want the width of the ball on the foot of the docks, the left side. Hadrian, can you tell me the width of the ball of the foot? Okay. <laughs> left. So, so- Got it. Okay. The width of the ball of the foot. The width of the ball of the foot. The width of the ball of the foot is four inches. Wait, the ball is like this front part, right? That's the ball. Or is it the back? The ball is the front. The ball is the front, the, right? The ball, yeah. You want to know from the bunion. They want the widest Yeah, part. right? So it's, that's four inches. The widest part. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's four inches, the widest part. There you go. Yeah. That was it, right? Can you tell me the width of the measure? Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Approximately. And um, V is still V still has these Prada sunglasses. If anyone's interested. I'm sorry. These are insane. Like these are so good. Yeah. I feel like they look so good on you. Can you I not know. wear those to church either? It's my shape. Um, it just feels a little extra, like unnecessary. Um, also, I don't know if they're polarized or not. And I just, you don't understand, like my shades, I destroy, these are not going in the care. These are not going in the Caribbean on a mission trip. It's not happening. Okay. My blenders go in the Caribbean. Could you imagine I take these to Puerto Rico on a mission trip and then I take them in the ocean and lose them? (laughs) Maria V doesn't have any Starbucks keychains right now, but send her when you when you send her your email later on, let her know what you're interested in and she'll see if she can find them. My store got a restock of all the keychain colors and all the tumbler colors, and then they got more tumblers. And I was in there yesterday morning and they still had gold tumblers. I know (gasps) that. I hope they still have them tomorrow morning. Well, I'm going to go tomorrow. Um, I think I'm going to go to Portland tomorrow and go sourcing and do a okay. sale tomorrow night. But either way, I'm going to go to Starbucks. Like, let's be very real. So. <laughs> I feel like I'm going to go to Starbucks tomorrow, too. But my <laughs> Starbucks won't have any cups. Because they, they literally sell out. Like, I talked to the girl, like, we sold out in an hour. Like, what time do you guys open? 4.30. So and I'm like, oh, we're going to go to Starbucks at 4.30 to get a cup. And they only raise the price on them because of the collectors. It's not even the resale market. It's because of the collectors. Because this is the thing about anything that is collectible, okay? You guys, anything that is designed to be collectible is not collectible. That's why your Barbies in the box from 1995 are worth nothing. Because they were designed to be collectible. And then what happens is that everybody has the same Barbie in the same condition, right? They're all tens. Everybody's Barbie is in great condition. It's like Beanie Babies. All the Beanie Babies were in the same condition. They all had the tag protector and that's why they weren't worth anything. And they were worth something when people actually used them. And then there was like, you know, 
one or two in good condition left. But the Starbucks cups, these were these are utilitarian, right? Like these were designed to be used, not to be put on a shelf for display. And then over time, people started collecting them, right? Like they were not designed to be a collectible. So now they <laughs> I'm just laughing because mine are all on display. But now they all have value because like anything in life that is designed to be a collectible will not hold value. But these were never designed to be a collectible. A cult following made them collectible. The same way that a cult following made squish balls collectible. And like, I don't even freaking know. Like those little department 56, like Christmas villages, right? Like, <laughs> yeah, globals. like so many things in life that are collectible were not made to be collectible. Nope. Nope. So don't trust collectibles. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Say it. Say it, girl. <laughs> Maria, love it. Ba, ba, ba. Mm, CF, yeah, they did a thing at all gym. We're going to get a dime for those here. Oh, CF. I dropped my cup in my kitchen, this one, and now there's like this little rattle inside of it. Like this one does not have it. I think like a tiny piece of like something inside is like stuck now and it like rattles. That would drive me crazy. It's fine. <laughs> not for me. Ah, I'm out of pieces. Are you out of pieces? I'm never out. But we should just end it here already because it's already late. <laughs> <laughs> Adrian's like, I'm done working for y'all. I'm out. I got, I gotta finish getting ready for Thanksgiving. I hope everybody has a wonderful Thanksgiving. Yeah, are you doing anything fun? Oh, you gotta do the giveaway. Yeah, we're gonna do the giveaway right now. Yeah. Hey, Adrian, this is like really embarrassing. What? Um, I don't have plans. <gasps> yeah. And my mom didn't call me, so. No way. Not that I want to go there. I don't want to go to my mom's. Yeah, I just wanted the invite. I wasn't going to go. No, I don't want to go there. No. Like, single life is weird. No. When you're... I was in a relationship for six years, and I always had plans. So then I feel like my family is like, oh, she has plans. You know what I mean? So it's like... But it's fine. Like, I'm not, like, mad about it. I just, like, want the traditional meal. So I might have to go to, like, Sherry's. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta find somewhere in town that has, like, takeout for, like, good Thanksgiving dinner. Because, like, I want it, but I don't want to, like, make it. Uh, well, you could just fly down to California. Ugh. Come over here. Oh, it's so much I food. Oh, my God. Hadrian's mom's meal for Thanksgiving. You don't even yeah. want to know. It's going to be... She's cooking right now. God, I love her. She's <laughs> flawless. She's a flawless human. She's perfect. Just put some on dry ice and ship it north. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. If you haven't gotten a chance to enter the giveaway yet, here is the link one more time before we pick our winner. Enter the giveaway. Enter the giveaway. I'm going to call them the, the Thanksgiving yep. key sunglasses. Hey, ladies. And black metal. If they want to get buck wild. <laughs> oh, I can hit him up style. That's how you get revenge. You take his cash. You spend it for all the hard times. Oh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I've been seeing a chef. Stop it, you have? No way. Has he been making you amazing food? Happy Thanksgiving, Sally. All right, we're going to pick the winner now. Let me put the... Oh, my gosh. Hey, Drain. Here. Dude, those glasses. <laughs> I'm just seeing you in them on here. I know. They're giving, like, pop star. <laughs> oh, like, right? K-pop? Yes. Yes, they're giving K-pop. <laughs> All right, we're going to pick the winner in three, two, one. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, wait, 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 whisper it. Whisper it to me. I need to know. Lip it. Our winner is Sally Wynn. Sally Wynn, don't leave. Woo! Me.
<laughs> Dolly! And she's Dolly. the last one to left the comment, too. As always, I am thankful for my daughter, also grateful for my family and friends, and Hadrian's life still, and coming other beautiful people in here. Oh, thank you so much, Sally. And congratulations, you are the winner of these super fun sunglasses. Oh, Yay! Yes, Woo! Yes. Congratulations! Yes, dog girl! Yay! Yes. All right, and thank you everyone for joining us tonight. And V, Woo! thank you for being here. It's so much fun as always. We gotta do this again very soon. And um, V, restart. everyone, if you purchase anything from V, make sure to send her an email. And yeah, okay, make sure to send her an email. That way, you guys have each other's info. I love it. I'm here for it. It was a journey. And if you want anything after the sale, same thing. Yeah, and if you're watching this live after the live ends, I'm going to have everything listed down below in the description box. Everything's going to be separated by what I had and what V had with the numbers and prices and all that goodness and availability. So check down below in the description box. Everything should be in there. And yeah, thank you guys again for joining us tonight. Happy Thanksgiving. Um, oh, and I did tell you guys I was going to go live for a little bit on Thanksgiving so you can say hi to the family. For anyone that wanted oh, to. Yes. That should be really fun. It's going to be at 5 o'clock. I already... Yeah. We figured out the time. So are you 5, 5 p.m. Pacific time. Are you doing a show on Friday? On Friday? Yeah. Friday yeah. night, I think. Yeah. Okay. I'm, li I'm live thrifting at 2 on Whatnot. My Ooh. Partner. All right. V is going live at 2 on Whatnot. At the Friday. thrift. Yeah. My thrift, I mean the best consignment store on the planet. <laughs> But don't forget to give her a follow on Instagram. You'll be updated whenever she goes live on whatnot. And check out all of her selling platforms. Poshmark, Mercari, Depop. She's literally everywhere. And she's the best. So uh, no, thank you, you again, V, for joining. Yeah. And everyone else, thanks for being here. And happy Thanksgiving. And we'll see you guys all in the next one. Thank all right, you bye, guys. guys. Adios. Bye. Bye. Bye.